Hey, what do you enjoy doing in your free time? I love outdoor activities. How about you? I'm into hiking and camping. It's so refreshing. That's awesome. I enjoy cycling and swimming. Have you ever gone on a hiking trip before? Yes, I went hiking in the mountains last summer. How was it? Any memorable experiences? It was incredible. I saw a stunning waterfall up close. Wow, that sounds amazing. I should try it sometime. Definitely. It's a great way to connect with nature. Do you have any favorite cycling routes nearby? There's a beautiful scenic trail by the river. It's perfect. I'll have to check it out. It sounds lovely. Let me know if you need any recommendations. Thanks. I appreciate it. I'll keep that in mind. Hey, have you thought about your summer vacation yet? Yes, I've been thinking about it. Any suggestions? Well, how about going to the beach? It's always a popular choice. Hmm, I do love the beach. Which beach would you recommend? I've heard great things about Clearwater Beach. It's known for its pristine white sand. That sounds amazing. How far is it from here? It's about a two-hour drive from here. We can rent a car and make a road trip out of it. That sounds like a lot of fun. Should we book a hotel in advance? Definitely. It's better to have everything planned beforehand and avoid any last-minute hassle. All right. I'll start looking for hotels with good reviews. Great. While you do that, I'll research fun activities and attractions in the area. Perfect. We should make a list of must-see places. Absolutely. We can also check if any water sports or boat tours are available there. I'd love to try some jet skiing or maybe even parasailing. That sounds adventurous. We should also pack some sunscreen and beach essentials. Good point. I'll make sure to bring some beach towels and a beach umbrella. Perfect. Let's also decide how long we want to stay there and book the time off work. I can take a week off, so maybe we can plan for a five-day trip? Sounds like a plan. Let's finalize the dates and start making all the necessary arrangements. Agreed. I can't wait for our beach vacation. It's going to be so much fun. Hey, how's it going? Been up to anything interesting lately? Not much, just been exploring a new hobby. How about you? Oh, really? What hobby are you into now? I've started painting. It's been so relaxing and therapeutic. That sounds amazing. What kind of things do you paint? Mostly landscapes and still life. I love capturing nature's beauty. That's really cool. Have you taken any classes or learned on your own? I'm learning through online tutorials. It's convenient and cost-effective. That's smart. Are you planning to showcase your paintings someday? I haven't thought about it yet. For now, it's just a personal hobby. Well, if you ever change your mind, I'd love to see your artwork. Thanks, I'll keep that in mind. What about you? Any new hobbies? I've been getting into photography. It's a great way to capture memories. Photography sounds exciting. What subjects do you enjoy shooting? 
I love street photography and capturing candid moments of people. That must be so interesting. Do you use a professional camera? No, I actually use my smartphone. It's amazing what it can do nowadays. That's impressive. I may have to give it a try myself someday. Absolutely. It's a fun and rewarding hobby. Let me know if you need tips. I'll definitely keep that in mind. Thanks for sharing. It was great talking to you. Likewise. Let's catch up again soon. Take care. Sounds good. Take care too. Bye. Hey, do you enjoy watching or playing sports? Absolutely. Sports are my passion. How about you? I'm not a big fan but I like playing soccer occasionally. That's great. Soccer is so popular worldwide. Yes, it's a fun and intense game. What about you? Well, my favorite sport is basketball. I love playing it. Basketball is indeed exciting. Do you watch NBA games? Yes, I do. The skills of professional players amaze me. Who's your favorite basketball player then? I would say LeBron James. He's remarkable in the game. Oh, I've heard a lot about him. He's really talented. Absolutely. He's an icon in the basketball world. It's fascinating how sports bring people together, right? Definitely. It's a universal language that connects us all. Hey, have you thought about our weekend plans? Yeah, I think we should go on a getaway. Any ideas? How about a road trip to the countryside? It's relaxing. Sounds great. What activities can we do there? We can go hiking, visit local markets, and try fishing. Excellent. Should we book a hotel or look for a cottage? Let's go for a cottage. It'll be cozy and more private. Agreed. Do you know any good places to rent one? I heard about a website where people list their cottages. Perfect. We should start browsing and compare options. Definitely. Let's make sure it's near a beautiful lake. I'll check that. What about food? Should we cook or eat out? How about a mix? We can cook breakfast and try local restaurants. Sounds like a plan. Let's pack some snacks too. Good idea. We can have picnics during our hikes. I'm getting excited. Can we invite some friends too? Sure. Let's ask if they'd like to join us on this adventure. Great. I'll reach out to them and see who's available. Hey, I was wondering if you'd like to go shopping with me this weekend? Sure, that sounds like fun. What time are you thinking? How about we meet at the mall at 11 o'clock in the morning? Sounds good. Do you have any specific stores in mind? Well, I need to buy some new shoes, so we can start there. Great. I also need to get a new sweater, so we can check out the clothing stores too. Perfect. It'll be nice to have some company while shopping. Definitely. We can also grab lunch at the food court. What do you think? That's a good idea. I've heard they have a new restaurant with delicious burgers. Sounds tempting. Should we make a reservation just in case it's busy? I don't think it'll be necessary, but we can call ahead and check if they take reservations. 
All right, let's do that. Oh, and don't forget to bring your shopping list. Good point. I'll make sure to write down everything I need before we go. Perfect. I'm looking forward to our shopping trip this weekend. Me too. It'll be a great opportunity to catch up and have some fun. Hey, do you want to hit the gym later? Sure, I could use some exercise. What time? How about around 6 p.m.? Sounds good. Which gym should we go to? There's a new one that just opened downtown. Great, let's meet there. Do we need to bring anything? Just your workout clothes and a water bottle. Got it. How long should we plan for the session? Let's aim for an hour, enough to get a good workout in. Perfect. Should we do some cardio or focus on weights? Maybe start with cardio to warm up, then move to weights. Sounds like a plan. Should we set any specific goals? Let's focus on increasing our endurance and strength. Agreed. After the gym, want to grab a healthy dinner? Definitely. I know a nearby place with nutritious options. Awesome. I'm looking forward to it. See you at 6. See you then, and let's make this a regular thing. Okay. Nice weather we're having today, isn't it? Yes, it's such a beautiful day. Sunny and warm. I love when the weather is like this. Makes me happy. Me too. It's so refreshing and puts me in a good mood. Did you hear it's going to rain tomorrow? Oh, really? I hope it won't be too heavy. The forecast says it'll be a light drizzle, just enough to cool things down. That's not too bad. I can handle a little rain. Yeah, me too. It'll be a nice change from the sunny days. Definitely. Plus, it's good for the plants and the environment. That's true. Rain is essential for nature to thrive. It's amazing how the weather affects everything around us. It really is. It has such a big impact on our daily lives. Well, let's enjoy the sunshine while it lasts. Hey, how was your week? Any plans for the weekend? It was quite busy, but I'm glad it's Friday. No plans yet, what about you? I'm thinking of going hiking. There's a nice trail nearby. Wanna join? Sounds tempting. I haven't hiked in ages. What time are you going? I plan to start around 9 a.m. It's a moderate trail, so it won't be too tough. Great. I'll join you. Should we bring some snacks for the hike? Definitely. I'll pack some sandwiches and fruits. Anything else we need? We should bring plenty of water to stay hydrated. I'll bring a couple of bottles. Perfect. Let's meet at the trailhead. Do you need a ride or will you meet me there? I can meet you there. I live nearby, so it's just a short walk for me. Sounds good. How about we meet at the entrance sign at 8.45 a.m.? That works for me. I'll see you there tomorrow morning. Looking forward to it. Likewise. It'll be a nice break from the city. See you tomorrow and have a good night. Hi, I'm planning a trip and need some help with booking a hotel room. Sure, I'd be happy to assist you. Where are you planning to visit? 
I'll be traveling to London for a week. Any recommendations? London has a variety of options. What is your budget for accommodation? I'm looking for something affordable, around $100 per night. Okay, I can suggest a few budget-friendly hotels in convenient locations. That would be great. Can you provide me with their names and addresses? Of course. One option is the London Central Hotel on 456 High Street. Is it close to any tourist attractions or public transportation? Yes, it's within walking distance to several attractions and near a tube station. Sounds promising. What other hotels would you recommend? Another option is the Riverside Inn, located on 789 River Street. Is it still within my budget and accessible to transportation? Yes, it falls within your budget and has easy access to buses and trains. Great. Which one do you think would be the better choice? Considering your budget and proximity to transportation, I recommend the London Central Hotel. Okay, I'll go ahead and book a room there. Thank you for your help. You're welcome. If you need any further assistance, feel free to ask. Enjoy your trip. Good morning. Have you decided what you want to order today? I'm not sure yet. Let me look at the menu first. Take your time. They have a variety of options here. I see they have sandwiches, salads, and some hot dishes. The sandwiches are quite popular here. Maybe you can try one of those. Yes, that sounds good. I'm in the mood for something light. How about the chicken avocado sandwich? It's delicious. That sounds perfect. I'll go with that. Great choice. Can I suggest adding some fries on the side? Hmm, I think I'll pass on the fries. Maybe a side salad instead. Sure thing. They also have a Caesar salad that's really good. I love Caesar salad. I'll have that as a side, please. Wonderful. Let's call the waiter and place our orders. Hey, I'm thinking about planning a weekend getaway. Any suggestions? Sure. What kind of destination are you interested in? Something relaxing, with beautiful scenery and outdoor activities. How about a cabin in the mountains? It's perfect for hiking and enjoying nature. That sounds great. Any specific location you recommend? I've heard good things about the Blue Ridge Mountains. It's picturesque and peaceful. That sounds perfect. How do we get there from here? We can either drive or take a short flight to the nearest airport and then rent a car. Driving sounds more convenient. How long does it usually take? It should take around four to five hours depending on traffic and the route we choose. All right, let's plan for a three-day trip. What should we do once we're there? There are plenty of hiking trails, scenic drives, and even waterfalls to explore. Sounds like a great adventure. Should we book the cabin in advance? Yes, it's always better to book ahead to ensure availability, especially during peak seasons. All right, let's book it. Do we need to bring any specific gear or equipment? Definitely bring comfortable shoes for hiking, sunscreen, and some warm layers for the evenings. Noted. I'm excited for this trip. Do you recommend any local restaurants? 
Absolutely. I can look up some highly rated local restaurants for us to try while we're there. Great. I'll leave the dining choices to you then. Thanks for all the help. You're welcome. It's going to be a fantastic weekend. Let's start planning right away. Hey, what are you doing this weekend? Not sure yet. Thinking of going to the movies. That sounds fun. Any movie in mind? I heard there's a new action movie out. Interested? Yeah, I enjoy action movies. What time does it start? The show times are at 3 p.m. and 7 p.m. Let's go for the 7 p.m. show. Works for you? Perfect. Shall we meet at the theater entrance? Sure. Should we get our tickets online in advance? That's a good idea. We can avoid the crowd too. I'll check the movie theater website for ticket availability. Great. Let me know and I'll Venmo you my share. Sounds good. I'll text you once I've got the tickets. Can't wait. It'll be a fun evening at the movies. Hey, did you see the weather forecast for this weekend? No, I haven't checked. What does it say? It's going to be sunny and warm, perfect for a picnic. That sounds great. We should definitely plan one. I was thinking we could go to the park near the river. Oh, I love that spot. The view is amazing there. Exactly. We can pack some sandwiches and fruits. Don't forget the sunscreen and a blanket as well. Of course, I'll make a list of what we need to bring. That's a good idea. We should also bring some water. Yes, staying hydrated is important, especially in the heat. Maybe we can also bring some outdoor games to play. That's a fun suggestion. We can play badminton or frisbee. Great. Let's finalize the picnic time and invite our friends. Sounds like a plan. I'll send out the invitations today. Hey, are you free this weekend? Yes, I have no plans. Why, what's up? I was thinking we could go hiking. What do you think? That sounds great. I love being outdoors. Awesome. I know a trail nearby. Shall we meet there? Sure. What time works for you? How about 9 a.m.? It'll give us plenty of time. Sounds good to me. Should we bring any snacks or drinks? Definitely. I'll pack some sandwiches and water bottles. Great. I'll bring some fruits and energy bars as well. Perfect. We should also remember sunscreen and hats. Right. Sun protection is important. Anything else? Just comfortable shoes and a backpack for essentials. Got it. I'll make sure to wear appropriate clothes too. Excellent. I can't wait for our hike this weekend. Me neither. It'll be a fun and refreshing experience. Hey. Are you going to the gym later? Yeah, I try to go a few times a week. Why? I've been wanting to start working out again. Can I join you? Of course. The more, the merrier. What time works for you? How about around 6 p.m.? Is that too late? Not at all. I usually go around that time too. Let's meet there then. Great. 
What kind of exercises do you usually do at the gym? I usually start with some cardio on the treadmill and then move to weightlifting. Sounds good. I need to work on both my endurance and strength. We can focus on different exercises based on our goals. It'll be motivating. Definitely. I'm looking forward to getting back into a fitness routine. It's always easier when you have someone to work out with. We'll keep each other accountable. I appreciate you letting me tag along. See you at the gym later. No problem at all. See you there, and let's get those workouts done. Good afternoon. Have you decided what to order? Hi there. Not yet. I'm torn between a salad or a sandwich. How about trying their specialty sandwich? It's delicious. That sounds tempting. Is it a vegetarian option? Yes, it is. It has grilled vegetables, cheese, and pesto. Great. I'm going to go with the specialty sandwich then. Excellent choice. Would you like any sides with that? Hmm. How about a side of fries? I'm craving something savory. Sure. Fries it is. And what would you like to drink? I'll have a cold lemonade, please. That sounds refreshing. Perfect. I'll place the order for a specialty sandwich, fries, and a cold lemonade. Thank you so much. I can't wait to dig in. You're welcome. It should be ready in a few minutes. Enjoy your meal. Thanks again. I'm sure I will. Hi, how are you? Got any interesting hobbies lately? Hey, yeah, I've actually picked up baking. It's been quite fun. Oh, that's cool. What kind of baked goods do you like making? Mostly cakes and cookies. I've been experimenting with different flavors. Any favorites so far? I made a chocolate salted caramel cake last week. It was amazing. Wow, that sounds delicious. I'm getting hungry just thinking about it. Well, if you'd like, I can bake one for you sometime. That would be amazing. I'd love to try your baking. Great. I'll make sure to let you know when I'm baking next. Thanks, I appreciate it. So, apart from baking, do you have any other hobbies? Yeah, I also enjoy playing the guitar. It helps me relax after a long day. That's wonderful. Can you play any songs? I can play a few popular ones, nothing too complicated though. It would be nice to hear you play someday. Maybe we can have a jamming session. I'd love that. We can bake and play some music together. Sounds like a plan. Looking forward to it. Hi. How's your fitness journey going? Have you reached any of your goals? Hey. Yes. I'm making progress towards my fitness goals. How about you? That's great. I'm struggling a bit, but I'm determined to get healthier. I understand. It can be challenging at times. What's been the hardest part for you? Honestly, sticking to a consistent workout routine and eating healthy. How about you? For me, it's overcoming the mental barrier of pushing myself during workouts. I totally get that. It's all about mindset. Do you have any tips for staying motivated? Absolutely. Setting small achievable goals, tracking progress, and rewarding myself helps. Those are excellent suggestions. 
I'll give them a try. What type of exercises do you enjoy? I enjoy a combination of strength training and cardio exercises. How about you? I prefer low impact exercises like yoga and swimming. They're gentle on my body. That's great. Finding exercises you enjoy makes it easier to stay consistent. Definitely. It's important to make fitness a part of our lifestyle, not just a short term goal. Absolutely. Consistency is key. Let's continue supporting each other on this journey. I couldn't agree more. We've got this. Let's reach our fitness goals together. Yes, we can do it. Let's stay focused and celebrate our progress along the way. Hey, have you finished your shopping for the week? No, not yet. I still need to buy some groceries. What do you usually buy for your groceries? Well, I always buy fresh fruits and vegetables. Where do you usually go for grocery shopping? I usually go to the local supermarket near my house. Is it expensive to shop there? No, it's quite affordable and they have good quality products. That's great. Do they have a wide variety of items? Yes, they have a wide range of items from different brands. Do you prefer shopping at supermarkets or online? I prefer going to the supermarket as I like to see the products before buying. That makes sense. Are there any specific brands you prefer? I usually go for organic and locally sourced products. That's a good choice. Is there anything else you need to buy? I also need to buy some cleaning supplies and toiletries. Well, let's go together. We can make a shopping list. Sure, that would be helpful. Let's plan it for tomorrow. Hi there. How's your day going? Not too bad. Just trying to stay active. You? Same here. I've recently started a new exercise routine. Oh, really? What kind of exercises are you doing? I'm focusing on cardio, so I go jogging every morning. That sounds intense. How long do you run for? I start with a 30-minute jog and gradually increase it. That's impressive. Do you do any strength training too? Yes. I incorporate strength exercises like push-ups and squats. Are you following a specific workout plan? Not really. I found some online videos and mix things up. That's smart. How often do you exercise each week? I aim for at least five days a week to stay consistent. I wish I had that discipline. Any tips for staying motivated? Find a workout buddy or set goals to keep yourself accountable. I'll definitely give it a try. Thanks for the advice. You're welcome. Let me know if you need any more tips. Hey, it's finally the weekend. What do you have planned? I'm not sure yet. Maybe we could go hiking or have a picnic in the park. That sounds great. I've always wanted to explore some nearby hiking trails. Perfect. Let's meet at the park entrance at around 10 a.m. Is that okay with you? Sure, that works for me. Should we bring any snacks or drinks for the picnic? Definitely. I'll bring some sandwiches and fruits. How about you bring some drinks? Sounds like a plan. I'll get some water and maybe some soda as well. Great. 
Should we invite anyone else to join us, like our friends from the English class? That's a good idea. I'll ask them if they're interested and let you know. Awesome. It will be more fun if we have more people joining us. I agree. I'm really looking forward to spending time outdoors and practicing English. Me too. It's a great opportunity to enjoy nature while improving our language skills. Definitely. Let's make the most of the weekend and have a memorable time together. Hey, I heard you're planning a trip. Where are you going? Yeah, I'm thinking of visiting a new city. Have any recommendations? How about Berlin? It's a vibrant city with lots to see and do. That sounds great. How can I plan my itinerary for the trip? Start by researching the top attractions and landmarks in Berlin. Okay. Any suggestions on where I can find reliable information? TripAdvisor and Lonely Planet are good resources for travel planning. Thanks. I'll check them out. What about transportation in Berlin? The public transportation system is excellent. Buses, trains, and trams. Should I book a hotel in advance or can I find one on arrival? It's always better to book in advance to secure the best deals. Makes sense. Any tips for packing for a city trip like this? Pack comfortable walking shoes, a versatile wardrobe, and a map. Perfect. I'm getting excited. How long should I spend in Berlin? I'd say at least three to four days to fully explore the city and its attractions. Noted. Thanks for all your help. I can't wait for this trip. Hey, have you thought about what to do this weekend? Yeah, I was thinking of planning a weekend getaway. Any suggestions? How about exploring a nearby city? It's a perfect way to unwind. That sounds great. Which city would you recommend? How about going to the capital? There's so much to see and do there. Sounds interesting. What are some popular attractions there? Well, there's the historical museum, botanical gardens, and the famous cathedral. Oh, I'd love to visit the botanical gardens. Are they open on weekends? Yes, they are open on weekends from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. We can spend a whole day there. That sounds fantastic. What about accommodation? Should we book a hotel? Yes, it's better to book in advance. There are plenty of affordable options available. Great. Could you please help me find some good hotel deals online? Sure thing. Let's check out some reliable travel websites for the best offers. Thank you so much for your help. I'm really excited about this trip. You're welcome. It's going to be a fun and memorable weekend getaway for sure. Hi. Have you decided what you want to order? I'm thinking of getting a burger. How about you? I feel like having some pasta. Any recommendations? I heard their spaghetti carbonara is really good. Sounds delicious. I'll have that too. Great choice. Should we also get some appetizers? Maybe some garlic bread and a Caesar salad? Perfect. That should be enough for starters. Do you want anything to drink? I'm getting a lemonade. I'll have a glass of iced tea, please. All right. Should we ask for separate bills or split it? 
Let's split it. It's easier that way. Good idea. I'll call the waiter over. Thank you. I'm looking forward to the food. Hi. I've been thinking about planning a vacation. Got any suggestions? Sure. Where are you thinking of going? Maybe somewhere with beautiful beaches. Any recommendations? Well, have you considered the Caribbean islands? Oh, that sounds great. Which islands do you recommend? Barbados and Jamaica are popular choices for beach vacations. Are they expensive? It depends on the season and the accommodation you choose. Hmm. Any tips on finding affordable accommodations? You can compare prices on travel websites or consider renting a vacation home. That's a good idea. What about activities besides lounging on the beach? You can try snorkeling, visiting waterfalls, or exploring local markets. Sounds exciting. How long should I plan to stay? I'd suggest at least a week to fully enjoy everything. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Thanks for the suggestions. You're welcome. Let me know if you need any more help. Happy planning. Hey, have you given any thought to our weekend plans? Yeah, I was thinking it would be nice to go on a short trip. Any ideas? How about we explore a nearby town that we haven't been to before? That sounds great. We could do some research and find a charming bed and breakfast. Good idea. It would be nice to have a cozy place to stay. We can start looking online. Absolutely. We should also check out some local attractions and activities in that town. Definitely. Maybe we can do some hiking, visit a museum or try out a local restaurant. Sounds like a plan. Let's make a list of the places we want to visit and things to do. That way, we won't miss out on anything and we can make the most of our time there. Exactly. We should also make sure to pack comfortable clothes and essentials for the trip. Right. And maybe we can ask friends for recommendations or any must-see spots in the area. Good idea. It's always nice to have some insider tips. I'm getting excited about this trip. Me too. This is going to be a fun and relaxing weekend getaway for both of us. Hi there. How are you enjoying the party so far? Oh, I'm having a great time. The food is delicious, isn't it? Definitely. Have you tried the mini sliders? They're amazing. Yes, I had one earlier. So, do you know many people here? Not really. I only recognize a few faces. How about you? I came with a friend, so I know a couple of people. That's lucky. It can be daunting to mingle with strangers. Yes, it can be. But everyone seems friendly here, which helps. Absolutely. It's always nice to meet new people at these events. Agreed. I find it fascinating to hear different life stories. Oh, me too. Do you have any interesting stories to share? Well, I just got back from a backpacking trip in Southeast Asia. Wow, that sounds amazing. How was your experience there? Hey, have you been shopping for clothes lately? Yes, I went last weekend. I found some great pieces. That's awesome. 
Where did you go shopping? I went to a local mall. They have a good selection. Did you find anything specific that you were looking for? I was actually in search of a new dress for a wedding. Oh, nice. Did you find the perfect dress? Yes, I did. It fits perfectly and was on sale too. That's a win-win situation. What color is it? It's a lovely navy blue with floral prints on it. Sounds beautiful. Did you buy any other clothes? Yes, I also found a trendy pair of jeans and a blouse. Great choices. Did you try everything on before buying? Of course, the fitting rooms were open and spacious. It's important to make sure everything fits well. Absolutely, I wanted to avoid any returns or exchanges. Hi, have you ever booked a hotel before? Yes, I have. It can be quite overwhelming at times. I know what you mean. I'm planning a trip and need some advice. I'd be happy to help. What do you need advice on? Well, I'm not sure how to choose a hotel that fits my budget. One thing you can do is compare prices online. There are many websites that can help. That's a good idea. Any other tips for finding affordable hotels? Another option is to consider staying in a different area or a smaller hotel. I see. How about the location? Any recommendations on that? It really depends on what you want to do during your trip. I plan on visiting some popular attractions and restaurants. In that case, it's best to choose a hotel that is centrally located. That makes sense. What about amenities? Any must-haves? It depends on your preferences, but free Wi-Fi and breakfast are always nice. Great, I'll keep that in mind. Do you have any favorite hotel chains? I don't really have a favorite, but I usually check reviews before booking. That's a good tip. How far in advance should I book a hotel? It's best to book as early as possible to secure the best rates. All right. I will start my search soon. Thanks for all the advice. You're welcome. Have a great trip and enjoy your stay at the hotel. Hey, have you made any plans for the upcoming weekend? Not yet. Why? Do you have something in mind? I was thinking we could go on a weekend getaway. It would be fun. That sounds great. Where do you suggest we go? How about a nearby beach? There are a few options within driving distance. That sounds perfect. I would love to relax by the beach. We could also go hiking and explore the nature trails nearby. That's a good idea. I enjoy being in the outdoors. Let's make a list of things we need to pack for the trip. Sure. We should include sunscreen, towels, and swimwear. Don't forget snacks and drinks for the road trip. Of course. We should also bring a camera to capture the memories. I'll check for available accommodation options near the beach. Great. Let's book something soon before they fill up. I'll do some research and send you the best options I find. Sounds like a plan. I'm really looking forward to this getaway. Hey, how was your day? It was all right, just busy with work. How about you? 
Same here. By the way, do you have any evening chores? Yes, I have a few. I usually start with cooking dinner. That sounds nice. What do you usually prepare? I like making simple meals, like pasta or stir-fry dishes. That's great. After dinner, what do you do next? Well, I usually clean up the kitchen and wash the dishes. Cleaning up is important. Do you have any other chores? Yes, I have to do some laundry and fold the clothes. Laundry can be time-consuming. How do you unwind after that? I like to relax by reading a book or watching a TV show. That sounds like a nice way to end the day. Anything else? Not really, just some minor tidying up before bed. And you? I usually take a shower and then spend some time on my hobbies. It's good to have time for yourself. Well, have a good evening. Thanks, you too. Take care and see you tomorrow. Hey, how's it going? Have you been working out lately? Yeah, I've been hitting the gym regularly. It's been great. That's awesome. I've been wanting to get back into exercising. You should definitely give it a try. It has so many benefits. I know, but I find it hard to find the motivation to start. Well, how about we become gym buddies? We can motivate each other. That sounds like a plan. What type of workouts do you usually do? I try to mix it up. Cardio, strength training, and some classes. That sounds intense. Are the classes worth it? Absolutely. They're challenging but really fun. You should join me sometime. I might just take you up on that offer. Are there any specific classes you recommend? I really enjoy the spin and yoga classes. They're both great workouts. I've never tried spin before, but I love yoga. I'll definitely give them a go. Perfect. Let's plan for a gym session together soon. It'll be a lot of fun. Sounds like a plan. I'm excited to start this healthy journey with you. Hey, how's your fitness journey going? It's been great. I've been focusing on exercise and healthy habits. That's awesome. What type of workouts do you do? I try to mix it up with cardio, strength training, and yoga. How often do you exercise each week? I aim for at least five days a week, but I listen to my body. Any specific diet changes you've made? Yes, I've been incorporating more fruits and vegetables. Have you noticed any changes in your energy levels? Definitely. I feel more energized throughout the day. What about rest days? Do you take any? Yes, rest days are important for recovery and preventing injuries. Do you use any fitness apps or trackers? Yes, I track my workouts and steps with a fitness tracker. Have you seen any progress in your overall fitness? Absolutely. I've noticed improvements in my strength and stamina. Any tips for staying motivated on this journey? Setting small goals and rewarding myself has helped a lot. Thanks for sharing. I'll definitely try incorporating your tips. You're welcome. Good luck on your own fitness journey. Hey. Do you have any dietary preferences? 
Yeah, I'm actually a vegetarian. How about you? Oh, I'm a total meat lover. I can't live without it. That's interesting. What made you choose to eat meat? I grew up in a family where meat was a staple in every meal. I see. So, how do you feel about vegetarian dishes? Honestly, I've never really given them a fair chance. You should try some vegetarian options. They can be delicious too. I guess I've just never really thought about it. Any recommendations? You could start with some veggie burgers or pasta dishes with lots of veggies. That doesn't sound too bad actually. I'll give it a try sometime. Great. Let me know if you need any recipes or restaurant suggestions. Thanks. I appreciate it. Maybe we can go out to eat together sometime. Definitely. I'd love to introduce you to some great vegetarian restaurants. Hi there. Are you new in the neighborhood? Yes, I just moved in yesterday. Nice to meet you. Welcome. My name is Amy. What's your name? I'm Mark. It's nice to meet you too, Amy. So, Mark, where are you from originally? I'm originally from a small town in the Midwest. That's interesting. What brought you here? I moved here for work. I got a job at the local hospital. Oh, that's great. What do you do at the hospital? I'm a nurse. I've been working in the ER for a few years. Wow, that must be challenging. How do you like it so far? It can be intense, but I love helping people in need. That's admirable. Have you settled into your new place yet? Not completely. I still have some unpacking to do. If you need any help, feel free to ask. We're a friendly bunch. Thank you, Amy. I'll keep that in mind. Is there a good gym nearby? Yes, there's a gym just a couple of blocks away. I can show you. That would be great. I need to stay active and relieve some stress. Exercise is a great way to do that. Let's go check it out soon. Thanks for being so welcoming, Amy. I'm glad I moved here. We're happy to have you as our new neighbor, Mark. Hey, have you been grocery shopping lately? Yes, I went yesterday. What about you? I'm planning to go later today. Any recommendations? Well, they have a great sale on fresh produce this week. That's perfect. I need some fruits and vegetables. They also have a buy one, get one free deal on pasta. Oh, I love pasta. I'll definitely get some. Don't forget to check the expiration dates on products. Good reminder. I always forget to do that. Also, compare prices before choosing items. Absolutely. I want to get the best deals. And don't forget to bring reusable bags for the groceries. I always keep some in my car. Thanks for reminding me. No problem. Enjoy your shopping trip. Hi. I'm craving some delicious food tonight. What do you feel like eating? I'm in the mood for some takeout. How about ordering pizza? Pizza sounds good. Which toppings do you prefer? I love pepperoni and mushrooms, but let's go with half cheese for variety. Great idea. 
Should we order from our favorite pizzeria or try a new one? Let's try a new place for a change. I heard about a highly rated pizzeria nearby. Sounds exciting. Do they have an online menu for us to choose from? Yes, they do. I'll search it up and let you know their options. Perfect. While you look that up, I'll call and place the order. All right. I found the menu. They have a wide variety of pizzas, pastas, and salads. Let's stick to pizza for tonight. I'll call them now to place our order. Sure. And also ask how long it will take for the delivery to arrive. I'll do that. Just a moment, I'll be right back after I call them. Hey, I heard you're going on a beach vacation soon. Are you excited? Yes, I can't wait. But I'm a bit overwhelmed with packing. Any tips? Sure. Let's start with swimwear. Do you have a swimsuit that fits you well? Yes, I have one. But I think I'll need two. What about towels? It's better to have a thin, lightweight towel that dries quickly. Have you packed that? No, I haven't. Thanks for reminding me. Should I bring a hat or a cap too? Absolutely. Sun protection is essential. Don't forget sunscreen as well. Right. I'll grab a hat and buy sunscreen. What about footwear? Flip-flops or sandals would be ideal for the beach. Any preference? I like both, but maybe flip-flops will be easier to pack. How about clothes? Lightweight clothes like shorts, t-shirts, and loose dresses are perfect. Great, I'll pack those. Any other essentials I should keep in mind? Don't forget a beach bag, a reusable water bottle, and a good book to read. Will do. Thanks for your help. I feel more prepared now. No problem at all. Have an amazing time and don't forget to relax. Hey, have you been clothes shopping recently? Yes, I actually went yesterday. It was quite fun. Where did you go? Any good stores you recommend? I went to a mall nearby. They had a bunch of options. Did you find anything you liked? Yes, I found a great pair of jeans and a nice shirt. What was the price range like? Affordable? The prices were reasonable, not too expensive. That's good to hear. I need to update my wardrobe. I can help you out if you want. We can go together. That would be great. When are you free? How about this weekend? Does that work for you? Perfect. Let's plan to meet at the mall on Saturday. Sounds like a plan. I'll see you then. Hi, have you been shopping recently? Yes, I just bought some new clothes yesterday. How about you? I actually need to buy some new clothes too. Where did you go? I went to a department store downtown. They had a great selection. Did you find anything specific that you were looking for? Yes, I found a stylish pair of jeans and a few trendy t-shirts. It was a good haul. That sounds great. I'm looking for a new dress for a wedding. Any suggestions? Well, there is a boutique nearby that has a lovely collection of dresses. What type of dresses do they have? I prefer something elegant. They have a range of options, from elegant evening gowns to chic cocktail dresses. 
Perfect. I'll definitely check that boutique out. Is it expensive? Not really. The prices are reasonable for the quality and design they offer. That's good to hear. I don't want to spend too much. Did you try anything else? Yes, I also bought a comfortable pair of sneakers for everyday wear. Oh, nice. I might need some new shoes as well. Where did you find them? I found them at a sports store nearby. They have a nice collection of footwear. Great. I'll add that to my list. Thanks for the recommendations. You're welcome. Let me know if you need any more shopping advice. Enjoy. Hey, have you ever had to buy clothes for a special occasion? Yes, I have. It can be challenging. How about you? I'm actually looking for a dress for my sister's wedding. That sounds exciting. What style or color are you thinking of? I'm leaning towards a classic style in a pastel color. Any suggestions? How about a light blue A-line dress? It could look elegant. That sounds nice. Where do you recommend I go shopping for it? You can try the department stores downtown. They have a good variety. Great, I'll check them out. Any tips on finding the right size? Make sure to know your measurements and always try things on. I'll keep that in mind. Should I stick to my budget or splurge? It's up to you, but remember you'll probably wear it again someday. That's true. I'll keep an open mind. Thanks for your advice. No problem. Let me know if you need any help while shopping. I appreciate it. I'll definitely reach out if I have any more questions. Hey, I'm planning to go shopping this weekend. Wanna join? Sure. I need some new clothes too. Where should we go? How about the mall near our neighborhood? They have a lot of options. Sounds good. What are you looking for specifically? I need a new dress for a wedding I'm attending next month. Have you checked online for any style inspirations? Yes, I have a few ideas in mind. How about you? I need some trendy jeans and casual tops for daily wear. Let's make a list of the things we need to buy before going. Great idea. Let's also set a budget so we don't overspend. Definitely. We can start at the department store and then explore other shops. Sounds like a plan. I'm excited to find some great deals. Me too. I always enjoy shopping with you. Ready to go? Yes, let's go and have a fun shopping day while finding the perfect outfit. Hey, how was your week? It was hectic, but I'm glad it's finally Friday. How about you? Same here. I need some downtime. Any plans for the weekend? Not sure yet. Maybe catch up on sleep and relax at home. What about you? I was thinking of going for a hike. The weather forecast looks great. That sounds nice. Where are you planning to go? I heard there's a beautiful trail in the nearby mountains. Have you been? No, I haven't. Can you tell me more about it? It's called the Forest Trail. It's supposed to have amazing views and fresh air. Sounds tempting. Mind if I join you? I could use some nature therapy. Of course. The more, the merrier. We can start early in the morning. Perfect. 
I'll make sure to pack some snacks and water. What time should we meet? Let's meet at 7 am near the trailhead. Does that work for you? Sounds good. I'll set my alarm clock early. Looking forward to it. Great. It'll be a refreshing break from our usual routines. See you then. Absolutely. Thanks for suggesting it. See you bright and early on Saturday. Hey, I need your advice on something. Can you help me out? Sure. What's up? Well, I'm going to a wedding next week and I have nothing to wear. Oh, that's a common dilemma. Where are you planning to go shopping? I'm not sure yet. Any recommendations for clothing stores? How about checking out the new boutique that just opened downtown? Sounds good. Do they have a variety of options for formal wear? Absolutely. They have a wide range of dresses, suits, and accessories. Great. What should I consider when choosing a dress for a wedding? Firstly, consider the dress code. Is it formal, semi-formal, or casual? It's definitely a formal event. Any particular colors I should avoid? It's best to avoid wearing white, as that's typically reserved for the bride. Got it. Any other tips for finding the perfect dress? Pay attention to the fabric, fit, and comfort. You want to feel confident. That makes sense. Should I also consider the season when choosing? Yes, definitely. Lighter fabrics and pastel colors are great for summer. I'll keep that in mind. Thanks for all your helpful advice. You're welcome. Let me know if you need any more assistance. Will do. I'm excited to find the perfect dress now. Hey, have you ever gone on a road trip before? Yes, I actually love going on road trips. Where are you thinking of going? I was thinking of driving up the coast. It's a beautiful route. That sounds amazing. How long are you planning to be on the road? I think around two weeks. I want to take my time and explore different towns. Great. Have you planned your stops along the way? Not yet, but I've been doing some research. I want to visit some national parks too. That's a good idea. National parks offer stunning landscapes. Which ones are you considering? I've heard Yosemite and Sequoia are must-see parks. What do you think? Absolutely. Both are known for their breathtaking views. Don't forget to pack hiking gear. Good point. I'll make a note of that. Any other tips for a successful road trip? Make sure you have a reliable GPS and plenty of snacks for the journey. Oh, and lots of water too. I'll add those to my list. Do you have any favorite road trip memories? One of my favorite memories is driving along the Pacific Coast Highway. The views were incredible. That sounds incredible. I'm really looking forward to this road trip. Thanks for the advice. You're welcome. I'm sure you'll have an amazing time. Safe travels. Have you ever been on a solo trip before? Yes, I have. It was an amazing experience. How about you? No, I haven't, but I've been thinking about it. Any advice? First, decide on a destination that interests you. Where would you like to go? I've always wanted to visit Europe. Maybe Italy or France. Great choices. The next step is to research the best time to visit. 
Right. I don't want to go during peak tourist season. Any recommendations? Try visiting in the shoulder season, like spring or fall. It's less crowded. That sounds perfect. How long should I plan to stay in one place? It depends on your preferences. I usually stay at least three to four days in each city. That gives me enough time to explore and relax. Should I book accommodations in advance? Yes, especially during peak times. It's better to secure a place to stay early. Got it. What about transportation within the cities? Is public transport reliable? Yes, most European cities have excellent public transportation systems. That's convenient. Should I also plan out my daily activities in advance? It's good to have a rough idea, but leave some room for spontaneous adventures. I'll make sure to balance it then. Thanks for all the tips. You're welcome. I'm sure you'll have an incredible solo trip. Enjoy. Hey, I was thinking we could do something fun this weekend. Any ideas? Sure. How about going for a hike? There are some great trails nearby. That sounds good. What time should we meet? Let's meet at 10 a.m., so we have plenty of time for the hike. Sounds like a plan. Should we bring any snacks or drinks? Definitely. We should pack some sandwiches and water bottles. Great idea. Do you know if we need any special hiking gear? Just a good pair of sneakers or hiking boots should be fine. Perfect. Is there a specific trail you have in mind? I heard the Green Valley Trail is beautiful this time of year. Let's do that then. Shall we meet at the trailhead? Yes, let's meet at the main entrance. I'll send you the address. Sounds good. Can't wait for the weekend adventure. Me too. It'll be refreshing to be out in nature. Hey, have you gone grocery shopping yet? No, I plan to go later. Why, do you need anything? Yes, I need some eggs, bread, and milk. Should I get the organic or regular kind? Regular is fine. It's cheaper and tastes the same to me. Okay, I'll make sure to get the regular ones then. Thanks. Also, can you pick up some fruits and vegetables? Sure. Any particular ones you want? How about some apples, bananas, carrots, and broccoli? Sounds good. I'll write it down so I don't forget. Great. Don't forget to check for any discounts or deals. I always do. Is there anything else you need? No, I think that's everything. Thanks for helping me out. No problem. Happy to assist. I'll let you know if I find any offers. Hey, have you seen the latest fashion trends? Yes, I've noticed some interesting styles lately. What do you think about wearing bright colors? I love it. Bright colors can add a fun touch to any outfit. And what about animal prints? Do you like them? Animal prints can be a statement piece, but they're not for everyone. I agree. How about denim? It never goes out of style, right? Absolutely. Denim is a classic and versatile choice. What other trends do you think will be popular this season? I've heard that oversized blazers and wide leg pants are going to be big. 
Oh, I've seen people rocking those styles. They look so chic. Definitely. It's all about finding what suits you and your personal style. That's true. Fashion is a great way to express ourselves. Absolutely. It's always fun to experiment with different looks. Hey, have you been to the grocery store lately? Yes, I went yesterday. Why do you ask? I need to buy some groceries too. Did you find good deals? Yes, I found some great prices on fruits and vegetables. That's great to hear. Which store did you go to? I went to the one near my house. It's called Fresh Mart. Oh, I've heard good things about that store. Any other deals? Yes, they had a sale on canned food and snacks too. Sounds like a good place to go. Can you compare prices? Sure. What items are you planning to buy? I need to buy milk, bread, and eggs. Okay. At Fresh Mart, a gallon of milk is $2.99, bread is $1.50, and a dozen eggs is $1.99. Wow. Those prices are reasonable. I'll go there then. Don't forget to check other stores too, just to compare. Good idea. I'll check some other nearby stores as well. Let me know if you find any better deals. Happy shopping. Thanks. I will. See you later. Hey, planning anything fun for the weekend? Yeah, I was thinking of going hiking. How about you? Oh, that sounds interesting. I might go to the beach. Great idea. Which beach are you planning to visit? I was thinking of going to the one nearby, with the lighthouse. Ah, I know the one. It has beautiful views. What time are you going? Probably in the morning, around 10 a.m. What about you? I'll start my hike early, around 7 a.m., to avoid the heat. Smart move. Will you be hiking alone or with friends? I'll be going with a group of friends. It's more fun that way. I agree. Going with friends adds to the adventure. Definitely. We can share snacks and help each other out. Hey, what are you in the mood for? Shall we grab a bite at the cafe down the street? Sure, that sounds great. I could use a cup of coffee and a sandwich. Sounds good. Let's go and find a table. Oh, I need to check the menu first. What kind of sandwiches do they have? They have a variety of options like turkey, ham, and veggie. I think I'll go with the turkey sandwich. What about you? I'll have the veggie sandwich, please. All right, now let's see what their coffee options are. They have regular coffee, espresso, cappuccino, and lattes. I'll go with a cappuccino. How about you? I'll have a latte, please. Great. Let's go and place our order at the counter then. Sure thing. I'll handle the order. You find us a table. Sounds like a plan. I'll grab a spot by the window. Hey, how have you been spending your free time lately? I've recently started painting. It's quite relaxing. What about you? I've picked up gardening. It's a great way to unwind and connect with nature. That sounds wonderful. What kind of plants are you growing? 
I have a variety of flowers like marigolds, roses, and sunflowers. How about you? I'm growing herbs like basil, mint, and parsley. It's fun to use them in cooking. Definitely. Speaking of cooking, have you tried any new recipes lately? Yes, I've been experimenting with Indian cuisine. Made a delicious curry last week. Oh, that sounds interesting. I love trying different cuisines. Any recommendations? You should try making homemade sushi. It's fun and tastes absolutely amazing. That's a great suggestion. I'll give it a shot. Do you have any other hobbies? Well, I enjoy reading fiction novels and taking long walks in the park. How about you? I'm really into photography these days. It's a great way to capture memories. That's fantastic. It must be fun exploring and capturing beautiful moments. Hey, have you done the grocery shopping yet? No, I was just about to go. Need anything? Yes. Can you get some milk, bread, and eggs? Sure. Anything else on the list? We also need some fruits and vegetables. All right. I'll make sure to pick up a variety. Don't forget to check the expiry dates. I always do. No worries. Great. And grab some chicken for dinner, too. Got it. Anything else? Just the usual snacks and toiletries. Okay, I'll make sure to get those too. Perfect. Let me know if you find any good deals. Will do. See you in a bit. Hey, have you noticed how worn out my clothes look lately? Yeah, it's definitely time to go shopping for some new ones. I agree. I need a fresh wardrobe for the upcoming season. Where do you usually go shopping for clothes? I usually go to the mall. There are so many stores to choose from. That's true. Do you have any specific stores in mind? I like to check out different stores, but I've heard good things about Fashion Boulevard. I've been there before, they have a wide selection. Great, let's go there then. When are you available? How about this weekend? Saturday afternoon works for me. Perfect. Let's meet up at the entrance around 3 p.m. Sounds good. Do you have any particular clothing items in mind? I need some new jeans, a few shirts, and maybe a jacket. Cool, I'll keep that in mind. See you on Saturday. Looking forward to it. See you then. Hey, I was thinking about going on a weekend trip. Any suggestions? That sounds fun. How about visiting a nearby city or exploring a scenic countryside? I like the idea of exploring the countryside. Any specific place you recommend? How about going to the lakeside? It's peaceful and offers stunning views. That sounds perfect. Is it easy to reach by public transportation? Yes, there are regular buses that go there. We can check the schedule online. Great. Should we book accommodations in advance or find something on the spot? It's better to book in advance to ensure availability. I can help you with that. Thanks. That would be really helpful. Any suggestions for activities to do there? We can go hiking, rent a boat, or simply relax by the lake. What interests you? 
I'm up for some hiking and maybe renting a boat for a peaceful sail. Sounds good? Excellent choice. I'll look up some hiking trails and boat rental options for us. Thanks so much for helping me plan. I'm really looking forward to this trip. My pleasure. It's always fun to explore new places. Let's make it a memorable one. Hi, I heard you're looking for a new place to live. How's the apartment hunting going? It's been a bit challenging, but I'm trying to stay positive. How about you? I actually just found a great apartment yesterday. It's spacious and in a convenient location. That's awesome. How did you come across it? Did you use a real estate agent? No, I found it through an online listing website. It had all the details and photos I needed. Ah, I see. I've been browsing through those websites too, but haven't had much luck so far. Don't worry, it takes time. What are some must-haves you're looking for in an apartment? A balcony, natural light, and a pet-friendly policy are my top priorities. How about you? I definitely wanted a gym within the building and a dishwasher. Those were non-negotiable for me. Good to know. Did you schedule any viewings yet? I'm wondering if that's the next step. Yes, I set up a few viewings. It's important to see the place in person before making a decision. That's true. How long did the viewings typically take for you? I'm trying to plan my schedule. They usually lasted around 20 to 30 minutes. Some places were quick to show, while others took longer. I'll keep that in mind. Did you have to pay any fees up front when you decided on the apartment? Yes, I had to pay a security deposit and the first month's rent. It's common practice here. I see. That's good to know. I hope I find a great place soon. Thanks for sharing your experience. You're welcome. Best of luck with your apartment search. I'm sure you'll find something perfect. Hey, have you ever thought about planning a trip? Yes, I've been wanting to go on vacation for a while now. Where do you suggest? How about exploring a beautiful beach destination? That sounds great. Any specific place in mind? Well, I heard about this stunning island called Paradise Island. Oh, sounds like a dream. What activities can we do there? We can relax on the beach, go snorkeling, and even try water sports. Awesome. When should we go and for how many days? I was thinking about going in summer for a week. What do you think? Perfect. We can enjoy the sunny weather and make the most of our time. Agreed. We should start checking flight and accommodation options. Definitely. Let's also create an itinerary to make sure we don't miss out. That's a good idea. We can include a visit to the local markets and try the cuisine. Sounds like a plan. I can't wait to relax and have a memorable trip. Me too. It's going to be an incredible adventure. Let's start planning right away. Hi, I heard you're planning a vacation. Where are you thinking of going? Yes, I am. I've been considering a tropical beach destination. Any suggestions? How about Bali? It's known for its stunning beaches and vibrant culture. That sounds amazing. Are there any specific beaches you recommend in Bali? Definitely check out Kuta Beach for its great surf and vibrant nightlife. 
Sounds fun. I'll make a note of that. What about accommodations? There are plenty of resorts and hotels near the beach. Do you prefer luxury or budget? I'm on a budget, so something affordable but still comfortable would be ideal. I recommend checking out guest houses or hostels. They're usually cheaper options. Thanks for the tip. How about transportation once we're there? Bali has reliable public transportation, but renting a scooter or car is more convenient. I'll definitely consider renting a scooter. Any must-visit attractions in Bali? Tana Lot Temple and Ubud's Monkey Forest are popular tourist spots. Don't miss them. I'll add them to my itinerary. Any last-minute tips for traveling to Bali? Remember to pack sunscreen, insect repellent, and dress modestly when visiting temples. Great advice. I can't wait to explore Bali. Thanks for all your help. You're welcome. Have an amazing trip. Let me know how it goes. Have you ever tried practicing yoga? Yes, I have. It's a great way to unwind and relax. Absolutely. Yoga has so many benefits for both the body and mind. I completely agree. It helps improve flexibility and strength too. Not to mention it can also reduce stress and anxiety levels. That's one of the reasons why I started practicing it regularly. Have you noticed any other positive changes since you started? Definitely. It has improved my posture and overall balance. That's fantastic. Yoga is also known to enhance body awareness. Yes, it's amazing how it helps us connect with our own bodies. Plus, it can also improve sleep quality and boost energy levels. I've experienced that firsthand. Yoga really energizes me. It's great that you found something that works for you. Yes, and the best part is that anyone can benefit from yoga. I couldn't agree more. It's a practice suitable for all ages and fitness levels. Hey, do you have any plans for the weekend? Not yet. I'm open to suggestions. What about you? I was thinking we could go for a hike. It's been a while since we spent time outdoors. That sounds great. I love being in nature. Where should we go? How about the nearby National Park? It's got some amazing trails. Perfect. What time should we meet up? Let's aim for around 9.30 in the morning. That way, we can avoid the midday heat. Sounds like a plan. Should we bring our own snacks? Definitely. It's always a good idea to pack some water and energy bars. I'll make sure to bring enough for both of us. Will there be any fees? Yes, there's an entrance fee, but I've got a season pass, so you're covered. That's generous of you. Is there anything else we should keep in mind? Just wear comfortable shoes and bring sunscreen. Oh, and a hat might be useful too. Okay, I'll make a note of that. I'm really looking forward to our hike. Me too. It's going to be a fun and refreshing way to spend the weekend. Hi, Sarah. I'm thinking of hosting a dinner party next week. Would you like to come? Oh, I'd love to. What's the occasion? There's no specific occasion, just a casual get-together with friends. How about you bring a dish? 
That sounds perfect. I can make my famous chicken curry. What time should I arrive? Let's aim for 7 p.m. By the way, do you have any dietary restrictions or food allergies? No, I'm good with anything. Should I bring anything else besides the dish? Just yourself and your appetite. I'll take care of drinks and dessert. Sounds great. Can I bring a plus one? Of course. Feel free to bring a friend or significant other. I'll adjust the seating accordingly. Thanks for inviting me. I'll mark the date on my calendar. Should I RSVP? Yes, please. It will help me estimate the number of guests. You can RSVP via text or email. Noted. I'll let you know as soon as possible. Looking forward to the dinner party. Me too, Sarah. It's going to be a fantastic night of good food and great company. Hey, have you eaten yet? I'm hungry. No, I haven't. What are you in the mood for? I'm thinking something homemade. How about pasta? That sounds delicious. Are you up for cooking? Definitely. Maybe spaghetti with meatballs? Sounds good. Do you have all the ingredients? I can check. If not, we can go grocery shopping. Great. Let's keep it simple and add a salad too. Good idea. What dressing should we use? Let's go with a classic vinaigrette dressing. Perfect. Should we invite others to join us? Sure. We can ask our friends if they're free. All right. I'll make the phone calls. Let's start cooking. Sounds like a plan. I'll help you chop the vegetables. Hey. I'm in need of a new outfit for the party tonight. Any ideas? How about trying a trendy jumpsuit? It's a versatile option. Sounds good. Where can I find one that fits my budget? You can check out the local department store. They have a good selection. Do they have a variety of sizes and colors? Absolutely. They cater to all body types and have many color options. Great. What about accessories? I need some statement earrings. There's a boutique nearby that sells unique accessories. Wanna go? Sure. Let's go. Do they also have matching handbags there? Yes, they do. You'll find a wide range of stylish handbags as well. Perfect. Should we grab a quick bite before we start shopping? Sounds like a plan. There's a cafe next to the boutique. Let's go there. All right. Let's fuel up before we find me the perfect outfit. Agreed. We'll make sure you turn heads at the party tonight. Hi. I noticed you have a beautiful garden. Do you enjoy gardening? Thank you. Yes, I love gardening. It's my favorite hobby. How about you? I've always wanted to try it, but I'm not sure where to begin. Any tips? Start small with easy-to-grow plants like herbs or flowers. They're low maintenance. That sounds doable. What tools do I need to get started? Basic gardening tools like a shovel, gloves, watering can, and pruning shears are essential. Is there a best time of day to water the plants? It's best to water them early in the morning or late in the afternoon when it's cooler. How often should I water them? It depends on the type of plants, but generally, once or twice a week should be enough. 
Should I use any fertilizer or pesticides for my plants? Organic fertilizers are a great option to nourish your plants and avoid pesticides if possible. That's good to know. How long does it usually take for plants to grow? It varies, but you'll start seeing progress in a few weeks. Be patient and enjoy the process. I'll keep that in mind. Thanks for all your gardening advice. You're welcome. If you ever need more tips or help, feel free to ask. Happy gardening! Hey, did you go grocery shopping today? Yeah, I just got back. Why, what's up? I need some ingredients for a new recipe I want to try. What do you need? I might have some of it at home. I need chicken breasts, bell peppers, and onions. I have onions and bell peppers. You can take them. That's great. What about the chicken? Sorry, don't have any chicken. You have to buy it. No problem. I'll add it to my list. Thanks for the veggies. Anytime. Let me know if you need anything else. Will do. By the way, do you have any cooking tips? Sure. What kind of recipe are you trying to make? It's a stir-fry dish with lots of veggies and sauce. Ah, stir-fries are easy. Just make sure to cook the veggies on high heat. Got it. Anything else I should keep in mind? Don't overcook the chicken. It should be juicy, not dry. Thanks for the advice. I'll give it a try tonight. Good luck. Let me know how it turns out. Will do. Thanks again for the help. No problem. Enjoy your cooking. Hi. Have you ever thought about taking a vacation abroad? Yes. I've always wanted to explore new countries. Where would you recommend? Well, I've heard Greece is stunning. The beaches and history there are amazing. That sounds great. How long should we plan for a trip like that? I think a two-week vacation would be ideal. It gives us enough time to see everything. True, we wouldn't want to rush things. Do you have any suggestions on where to stay? I think renting a villa near the coast would be perfect. We can enjoy the view every day. That sounds like a dream. How do you suggest we get around once we're there? Renting a car would give us the freedom to explore at our own pace. What do you think? I agree. It would be more convenient. Are there any must-visit attractions in Greece? Definitely. The Acropolis in Athens is a must-see and Centurini's sunset is breathtaking. I'll make note of that. What about the cost? How much should we budget for the trip? It's hard to say, but I've heard Greece can be affordable. We can do some research on it. That's a good idea. We should compare prices before making any reservations. Absolutely. It's important to plan ahead to make sure we have a smooth and enjoyable trip. Hi there. Are you excited about our trip? Absolutely. I can't wait to explore a new place. How about you? Me too. Oh, look. There's the airport. Let's head inside. Sure. Let's grab a cart for our luggage. It seems quite busy today. You're right. We should check in quickly. Our flight leaves soon. Agreed. Let's find the check-in counter for our airline. I think it's this way. Follow me.
Great, we're next in line. Do you have our passports handy? Yes, right here. And don't forget our printed boarding passes. Got it. Oh, they're asking for our baggage weight. Is it within limits? I made sure of that. We should have no problems with the weight. Perfect. Now we just need to go through security and wait at the gate. Let's grab a snack from the shop. We can enjoy it on the plane. Good idea. I'm so excited for this trip. Let's make it memorable. Hi there. I'm starving. Have you thought about dinner tonight? Yes, I was just about to ask you the same thing. Any preferences? Well, I'm in the mood for something exotic. Maybe Thai or Indian. That sounds great. There's a new Thai restaurant downtown. Want to try it? Sure. What time works for you? How about we meet at 7 p.m.? That should give us enough time. Perfect. Shall we make a reservation, just to be safe? Absolutely. Do you mind taking care of it? I can be there a bit early. No problem. I'll make the reservation for 2 at 7 p.m. Great. I'll see you there. I'm really looking forward to trying Thai cuisine. Me too. I've heard their pad thai is amazing. See you later. See you later. Can't wait for dinner. Hi. Have you been keeping busy lately? Yes. I've actually been playing a lot of sports. That sounds interesting. Which sports do you enjoy? I really enjoy playing basketball and soccer. Oh, great choices. I used to play basketball in school. That's awesome. Do you still play occasionally? Not as much now, but I do enjoy watching basketball games. Watching sports can be just as fun. Which basketball team do you support? I'm a fan of the Lakers. What about you? I'm a big fan of the Golden State Warriors. Ah, the rivalry. It's always interesting to watch their games. Definitely. I also follow soccer. Do you like that too? I do enjoy watching soccer, especially during the World Cup. Who do you support in soccer? I usually support my home country's team, but I appreciate all the talented players. That's great. It's nice to have a variety of sports to enjoy. Absolutely. Sports are a great way to stay active and have fun. Definitely. Maybe we can play a friendly game of basketball sometime. That sounds like a plan. I'd love to shoot some hoops with you. Awesome. We'll have a great time. Hey, want to try a new recipe tonight? Sure. I'm always up for some cooking. What's on the menu? How about we make homemade pizza from scratch? That sounds delicious. Do you have a recipe in mind? Yes, I found one online. It seems pretty easy to follow. Great. What do we need for the dough and the toppings? For the dough, we'll need flour, yeast, water, and salt. Got it. And what about the toppings? I love veggies on my pizza. We can have tomatoes, mushrooms, bell peppers, and olives. Yum. Can we also add some cheese and pepperoni? Of course. We can personalize our own pizzas with toppings. That sounds fun. Should we start prepping the dough first? 
Yes, let's measure the ingredients and mix them together. Should we let the dough rise before shaping it into pizzas? Yes, we'll cover it and let it rise for about an hour. While we wait, we can chop the veggies and shred the cheese. Good idea. It'll save us some time later on. I can't wait to see how our homemade pizzas turn out. Me too. We'll have a great meal and lots of fun cooking. Hey, I'm in desperate need of some new clothes. Oh, really? What kind of clothes are you looking for? I'm thinking of getting some new jeans and a few tops. That sounds like a good plan. Where are you planning to go shopping? I was thinking of checking out the mall downtown. That's a great idea. They have a lot of clothing stores there. Yeah, I remember seeing a few trendy shops last time I was there. Do you have any specific stores in mind to start with? Not really. I'm open to exploring different options. Well, you can start by checking out the department stores. Good idea. They usually have a wide selection of clothing. And don't forget to compare prices before you make any purchases. Definitely. I want to make sure I'm getting a good deal. Let me know if you need any help or suggestions. Thanks. It's always more fun to shop with a friend. You're welcome. I'm happy to lend a hand. Enjoy your shopping. Hi, how are you? Have you been keeping up with your workouts? Hey, I've been trying my best, but it's been tough. I understand. Finding time can be challenging. What's your routine like? I usually start with 10 minutes of stretching, then do cardio for 30 minutes. That sounds great. What type of cardio exercises do you do? I prefer running on the treadmill or cycling on a stationary bike. Those are effective exercises. Do you incorporate strength training too? Yes, I do. I lift weights for about 20 minutes after my cardio workouts. Good for you. It's important to build strength as well. How often do you exercise? I aim for at least three times a week, but sometimes life gets in the way. I completely understand. Consistency can be a challenge. Any tips for staying motivated? Setting achievable goals and finding a workout buddy helps keep me on track. That's a great idea. I might try that. What about your diet? Do you follow a specific plan? I try to eat a balanced diet with lots of fruits, vegetables, and lean proteins. Sounds like a healthy approach. Any favorite healthy snacks or meals? I love Greek yogurt with berries for a snack and grilled chicken salad for lunch. Yum! Those sound delicious. I'll definitely try them out. Thanks for sharing your routine. No problem. It's always nice to talk about fitness. Keep up the good work. Hey, have you ever tried any fitness classes? Yes, I've done yoga and Zumba. What about you? I've tried kickboxing and Pilates. I love the variety. That's great. How often do you exercise? I try to work out at least three times a week. What about you? I aim for five days a week. It helps me stay energized. Do you follow a specific diet to stay healthy? I eat a balanced diet with lots of fruits and vegetables. 
That's smart. Any tips for staying motivated? Setting goals and rewarding myself keeps me on track. What about you? I find exercising with a friend or joining group classes motivating. That sounds fun. Let's plan a workout session together sometime. Hey, have you tried any new recipes lately? Yes, I've been experimenting with vegan dishes. That's cool. Do you have any recommendations? One of my favorites is a chickpea curry. It's easy to make. Sounds delicious. Could you share the recipe with me? Of course. You'll need chickpeas, coconut milk, and spices. How long does it take to cook? It takes about 30 minutes from start to finish. Great. I'll definitely give it a try this weekend. Don't forget to add some fresh cilantro on top for flavor. Thanks for the tip. I love cilantro. You're welcome. Let me know how it turns out. I will, and if it's a success, I'll share it with you too. Hey, what's your plan for the evening? I'm thinking about going to the gym. How about you? Oh, nice. I was planning to go for a run. Want to join? Sure, that sounds like a good idea. What time are you going? Around 5 p.m. Is that convenient for you? Perfect. 5 p.m. works for me too. Shall we meet at the gym? Yes, let's meet outside the gym. I'll see you there then. All right, see you at 5 p.m. sharp. Don't be late. Don't worry, I'll be there on time. Looking forward to it. Me too. It's been a while since we worked out together. Yeah, it'll be great to catch up and get some exercise in. Absolutely. We can motivate each other to push harder, right? Definitely. Let's make it a productive workout session today. Hey, I need to pick up some groceries. Want to come along? Sure, I could use some fresh air. Where are we going? Let's head to the neighborhood supermarket. It's close by. Great, what do we need to pick up? Do you have a shopping list? Yes, I made a list. We'll need fruits, vegetables, and bread. Should we also get some milk, eggs, and cheese? Definitely. We can also grab some pasta and canned foods. Any specific brand preferences for the products on the list? Not really, as long as they are good quality and affordable. That makes sense. How about snacks and drinks? Anything on the list? We can get some chips, cookies, and soda for the weekend. Sounds good. Oh, don't forget to grab some cleaning supplies too. Thanks for reminding me. We'll pick up some detergent and bleach. Anything else before we head to the checkout counter? I think that's it. Let's go and pay for our groceries now. Hi, how are you today? Do you have any hobbies? I'm good. Yes, I enjoy gardening. How about you? That's interesting. I love playing the guitar. Oh, really? How long have you been playing? Around five years now. It's a great stress reliever. I can imagine. What kind of music do you play? Mostly rock and blues, but I also like acoustic. Nice. Have you ever performed in front of an audience? 
Yes, I've played at a local cafe a few times. That's impressive. I've always wanted to try gardening. It's very fulfilling. What type of plants are you growing? Mostly flowers, like roses and sunflowers. Lovely. Do you have any tips for a beginner like me? Start with plants that are low maintenance, like succulents. Thanks for the advice. I'll definitely give it a try. You're welcome. Let me know if you need any help. Thank you. I appreciate it. We should swap hobbies sometime. That sounds like a great idea. Let's plan it soon. Hey, have you started planning our vacation yet? Yes, I already looked into booking accommodation. Great. Did you find any good options? Yes, I found a few hotels that seem nice and affordable. That's good to hear. Could you send me the links? Sure, I'll send them to you right away. Thanks. I'll check them out and let you know my thoughts. Take your time. We still have some time before the trip. True, but I want to make sure we get a good deal. Absolutely. I've been comparing prices and reviews. That's smart. We don't want to end up in a bad hotel. Exactly. I made sure to read reviews from previous guests. Did you consider the location as well? Of course. I looked for places near attractions we want to visit. That's important. We don't want to waste time commuting. Agreed. I also checked if they have free cancellation. Good idea. We might need to change our plans later. That's true. Flexibility is always nice to have. So, once I check the links, we can make a decision. Sounds like a plan. Let's book our accommodation soon. Hi. Have you decided what to order for lunch? Not yet. Let's take a look at the menu. Good idea. How about starting with some appetizers? Sure. What do you recommend? The chicken wings are always a popular choice. Sounds delicious. Let's get a plate of those. Great. Now, for the main course, any preferences? I'm in the mood for some pasta. What about you? Pasta sounds good. How about trying the carbonara? That sounds perfect. Let's go with the carbonara. All right. And for drinks, what would you like? I'll have a glass of lemonade, please. I'll go with an iced tea. Anything else? I think we're all set. Let's place the order. Okay. I'll call the waiter over. Hey, how was your weekend? Do anything interesting? Yeah, I actually started a new hobby. I've been painting. That's cool. What kind of paintings do you do? Mostly landscapes and portraits. I find it really relaxing. Do you have any tips for someone who wants to start painting? Sure. Start with basic materials like brushes and acrylic paints. Where do you usually get your art supplies from? There's a local art supply store near my house. They have everything I need. How often do you paint? Is it something you do every day? I try to paint at least a few times a week. It's my way to unwind. Have you ever thought about selling your artwork? Not yet, but maybe in the future. 
Right now, it's more of a personal hobby. Well, I'd love to see some of your paintings sometime. Definitely. I'll bring them next time we meet up. Hey, the weather is amazing today, isn't it? Yeah, it's perfect for a picnic. Let's plan one. Great idea. Which day works best for you? How about this Saturday? It's supposed to be sunny. Sounds good. Where should we have the picnic? How about the park near my house? It's beautiful. Perfect. We can bring some sandwiches and drinks. And don't forget the snacks and a blanket to sit on. I'll bring a frisbee too, for some outdoor games. Awesome. I love playing frisbee. What time shall we meet? Let's meet at 1 p.m. That way we can have a leisurely lunch. Sounds like a plan. I'm really looking forward to it. Me too. Hopefully, the weather stays nice till Saturday. Fingers crossed. It's going to be a fantastic picnic. Hey, how are you doing today? I'm good, thanks. What have you been up to? Actually, I've been exploring some new hobbies lately. That sounds interesting. What kind of hobbies? Well, I've started painting and playing the guitar. Oh, I love art and music. How long have you been doing that? I've been painting for about a year and playing the guitar for six months. That's impressive. Do you take lessons or learn by yourself? For painting, I've been taking classes, but for the guitar, I'm learning online. I admire your dedication. How often do you practice? I try to paint at least once a week, and I practice guitar for an hour every day. That's quite a commitment. Have you shown your artwork to anyone? Yes, I've participated in a local art exhibition and received positive feedback. That's fantastic. Any plans for future hobbies? I'm thinking of trying photography and maybe even learning a new language. Those sound like wonderful choices. Best of luck with your new hobbies. Thanks. And what about you? Do you have any hobbies you'd like to share? Well, I enjoy cooking and writing in my free time. It helps me relax and unwind. That's great. I'd love to try your cooking someday. Hey, have you gone shopping for new clothes lately? Yes, I actually went yesterday. How about you? I'm planning to go this weekend. Any recommendations? Well, there's a new department store that just opened downtown. Really? What's it called? It's called Urban Style. They have a great selection. That sounds interesting. What kind of clothes do they have? They have everything from casual wear to formal attire. Perfect. I need to find something special for a party. You should definitely check it out then. They have trendy dresses. Great. Is it expensive? Not at all. The prices are quite reasonable. That's good to hear. I don't want to overspend. Don't worry, you'll find something within your budget. Thanks for the recommendation. I'll definitely visit Urban Style. You're welcome. Let me know if you find something you like. Excuse me, can you help me find the nearest bus station? Sure. 
Where are you trying to go? I'm looking for the bus station that goes downtown. Ah, you're in luck. The nearest bus station is just around the corner. How long does it take to get to downtown from there? Usually, it takes about 20 minutes, but it depends on the traffic. Is there a specific bus number I should take? Yes, you need to catch the number 12 bus. Do I need exact change for the bus fare? No, most buses now accept contactless payment or you can use a transit card. Where can I get one of those transit cards? You can buy one at the convenience store next to the bus station. Thank you. Is there anything else I should know? Be sure to check the bus schedule, especially if you're traveling during rush hour. Will do. I really appreciate your help. You're welcome. Have a safe trip. Hey, have you heard? I'm looking for a new place to live. Oh really? What happened with your current apartment? Well, the rent keeps going up and the landlord isn't fixing anything. That's frustrating. Where are you thinking of moving to? I'm considering moving closer to my workplace. It would save me commute time. That sounds like a good idea. What kind of apartment are you looking for? I'm hoping to find a one-bedroom apartment with a balcony and parking space. Have you tried checking online listings or asking friends for recommendations? Yes, I've been browsing different websites and I've asked a few friends as well. Any luck so far? It can be tough finding the right place. I did find a couple of options that seem promising. I'll go check them out soon. That's great. Make sure to take note of any questions you have for the landlord. Good point. I'll also ask about the neighborhood and if there are any amenities nearby. That's a smart approach. Is there anything I can do to help with your search? Thank you for offering. If you hear of any available apartments, please let me know. Absolutely. I'll keep my eyes and ears open for you. Good luck with your search. Thanks. I appreciate it. Hopefully, I'll find the perfect place soon. Hey, do you want to go shopping this weekend? Sure, I'd love to. What do you need to buy? I need to buy a new pair of shoes and some groceries. That sounds good. Which store should we go to? Let's go to the mall. They have a variety of shoe stores. Great. What time should we meet up? Let's meet at the mall entrance at 10 a.m. Sounds good. How long do you think we'll be there? Maybe a couple of hours. I don't want to spend all day. That works for me. Is there anything specific you're looking for? I'm looking for sneakers with good arch support. I'll keep an eye out for those. And what about groceries? I'll pick up some fresh fruits, vegetables, and milk. Do you need help carrying the bags afterwards? That would be great, thanks. We can grab lunch too. Perfect. I'm excited for our shopping trip. Hey, have you seen the latest smartphones in the market? Yes, I'm actually thinking about buying a new one. Any recommendations? Well, it depends on your budget and what features you prioritize. I'm looking for a phone with a good camera and long battery life. 
In that case, the new models from XYZ and ABC could be worth considering. Great. Are they within an average price range? Yes, they are quite affordable compared to other high-end options. That's good to know. What about the storage capacity? Both offer different options, so you can choose based on how much storage you need. Perfect. I also need a phone with a large display for multimedia. I think both models have a good-sized screen, so you'll enjoy watching videos. Excellent. Are there any special features I should be aware of? The XYZ model has facial recognition, while the ABC model has a fingerprint scanner. Interesting. I'll consider those as well. Thanks for the advice. No problem. Let me know if you need any further information. Hey, the weather is so nice today. How about we plan a picnic? That sounds like a great idea. Where should we have it? How about the park near our neighborhood? It has a beautiful lake. That park sounds perfect. What time should we meet there? Let's meet around 11 a.m. That way we can have lunch there too. Sounds good. What should we bring for the picnic? We should definitely bring a blanket, some sandwiches, and fruits. I'll also bring some snacks and a frisbee for us to play with. Awesome. Don't forget to bring some water and juice as well. I'll make sure to pack enough drinks for everyone. Great. Should we invite anyone else to join us? Yes. Let's invite our friends Jack and Sarah. They'll love it. Sure. I'll text them right away and ask if they're available. Perfect. I can't wait for our picnic. It's going to be so fun. Me too. It's going to be a great day to relax and enjoy nature. Hey, any plans for the weekend? Not yet. Any suggestions? How about going for a hike? Sounds good. Where should we go? There's a nice trail in the nearby park. What time should we meet? Let's meet at 9 a.m. at the park entrance. Perfect. Should we bring snacks? Definitely. I'll bring some sandwiches. I'll bring some fruits and drinks then. Great. Do you have a hiking backpack? Yes. I have one. I'll bring it along. We should also bring a first aid kit. Good idea. I'll make sure to pack it. Is there anything else we might need? Maybe some sunscreen and insect repellent. Right. I'll bring those too. Anything else? I think we're all set for the hike. Awesome. Can't wait for the weekend. Me too. It's going to be a great day. Definitely. See you on Saturday then. See you there. Have a good rest of the week. Good morning. How did you sleep last night? Morning. I slept well, thanks. How about you? I had a good night's sleep. What's your morning routine like? Firstly, I wake up at 6.30 and make my bed. Then, I brush my teeth and wash my face. Sounds like a good start. What do you do after that? I usually prepare a healthy breakfast, like oats with fruits. Then, I check my emails. That's a great way to fuel your day. What do you do next? 
After breakfast, I get dressed and do some light stretching exercises. That's a good idea to stay active. What's your final step? I gather my belongings, double check everything, and head out for work. It seems like you have a well organized morning routine. Thank you. I find it helps me start my day on a positive note. What about you? I have a similar routine, but I also like to read a few pages of a book before heading out. Hey, do you have any ideas for the weekend? Actually, I was thinking of going for a hike. What about you? Oh, that sounds great. I'm up for some outdoor activity. Perfect. I heard there's a nice trail nearby. Shall we go there? Sure. That sounds like a plan. What time should we meet? How about meeting at 9 a.m.? That way, we can avoid the heat. Sounds good. Should we bring any snacks or drinks? Yes. Let's pack some sandwiches and water bottles. Great idea. I'll make sure to bring enough for both of us. Awesome. I'll bring my camera too. We can take some pictures. Excellent. We might have some stunning views on the trail. I can't wait. This will be a refreshing break from work. Absolutely. It's important to have a work life balance, right? Hey, I've been feeling stressed lately. Let's plan a weekend getaway. That sounds like a great idea. Where do you suggest we go? How about a cozy cabin in the mountains? It will be a peaceful retreat. That sounds amazing. What activities can we do there? We can go hiking, have a picnic, and enjoy the beautiful scenery. That sounds perfect. Should we bring our own food or eat out? Let's bring some snacks and cook simple meals at the cabin to save money. Good idea. We can also make a bonfire and roast marshmallows. Yes, that will be so much fun. Do you think we need to book in advance? It's better to be safe, so let's book the cabin and any activities beforehand. All right. I'll search for available cabins and check their reviews online. Great. We should also make a packing list and gather everything we need. Definitely. We'll need warm clothes, hiking gear, and toiletries. Don't forget some board games or cards for entertainment at night. Good point. I'll make sure to pack those as well. Can't wait for the trip. Me too. It will be a refreshing escape from our everyday routines. Hi. Do you want to grab a bite to eat? Sure. I'm feeling hungry. How about a cafe? Sounds good. Let's find a cozy one nearby. Agreed. I'm in the mood for a warm drink too. How about a cappuccino or a hot chocolate? Hot chocolate sounds perfect for this chilly weather. Great. And for food, what are you craving? Maybe a sandwich or a salad would be nice. I'm leaning towards a sandwich. Any preferences? A turkey sandwich with lettuce and tomato, please. All right. I think I'll go for a chicken salad. Sounds delicious. Let's find a cafe and place our order. We could try the one around the corner. Shall we go? Hey, have you finished grocery shopping for the week? Not yet. I'm making a list of what we need. 
Great. Let's make sure we have enough fruits and veggies. Definitely. We should also get some dairy products. How about some chicken breast for dinner this week? Sounds good. Let's grab some eggs too. Don't forget to buy some whole wheat bread for sandwiches. I'll add it to the list. We also need pasta and rice. True. And let's not forget to stock up on cooking oil. I'll make sure to add it to the list. Anything else? We're out of snacks, so let's pick up some chips and salsa. Right. And we need some cleaning supplies as well. Let's also grab some bottled water for emergencies. Good idea. I think our grocery list is complete now. Hey, how's it going? Not too bad, thanks. What have you been up to lately? Actually, I've been really getting into a new hobby. Oh, really? What kind of hobby is it? I've started learning how to play a musical instrument. That's awesome. Which instrument have you chosen? I decided to learn to play the guitar. That's cool. How long have you been practicing? I've been practicing for about three months now. Have you taken any lessons or are you self-taught? I'm self-taught for now but I might consider lessons in the future. Are you finding it difficult to learn on your own? It can be challenging at times, but I enjoy the process. That's great. Have you learned to play any songs yet? Yes, I can play a few beginner level songs. It's really satisfying. I can imagine. Any plans of performing in front of others? Not yet, but maybe someday. Right now, I'm just enjoying the learning process. Well, keep it up. It's always wonderful to have a hobby like that. Thanks. It's definitely been a fulfilling experience for me. Hey, how have you been? I'm good, thanks. How about you? I'm doing well too. So, what do you enjoy doing in your free time? I love reading books. How about you? Oh, I also enjoy reading. What kind of books do you like? I'm into mystery novels. What about you? I'm more into science fiction and fantasy. Any specific authors you recommend? Definitely Agatha Christie and Arthur Conan Doyle. They are amazing. I'll check them out. By the way, have you ever tried any other hobbies? Yes, I also like painting and playing the guitar. What about you? That's cool. I've tried my hand at photography and cooking. What's your favorite painting style? I enjoy Impressionism and Surrealism. How about you? I'm more into abstract art. As for cooking, what's your signature dish? I love making homemade pasta with a delicious tomato sauce. What about you? Sounds tasty. I enjoy making different types of stir-fry dishes. Do you have any other hobbies? Well, I also like hiking and exploring nature. What about you? Nice. I enjoy going to the gym and staying fit. Do you have any upcoming hiking trips planned? Yes, I'm planning a hike in the nearby mountains next weekend. How about you? Not at the moment, but I'd love to join you sometime. Anyway, it was great talking to you. Likewise, let's catch up again soon. Have a wonderful day. Hey, 
have you been going to the gym lately? Yeah, I've started going regularly. How about you? I've been slacking off recently, but I want to get back into it. That's great. What are your fitness goals? I want to lose a few pounds and build some muscle tone. Nice. Do you have a specific plan to achieve that? I was thinking of starting with cardio and weightlifting. Good idea. I usually warm up with some stretching too. I'll definitely incorporate stretching into my routine. How often do you plan on going to the gym? I'm aiming for at least three times a week. That sounds doable. We could go together if you want. That would be great. It's always more motivating with a buddy. Absolutely. Let's set a schedule and start next week. Hi. Have you ever thought about planning a weekend getaway? Yes, I've been wanting to take a short trip somewhere. Any suggestions? How about going to a nearby coastal town? It would be relaxing. That sounds perfect. Do you know any coastal towns that are close by? Well, there's a charming town called Seaside. It's just a two-hour drive. Oh, I've heard great things about Seaside. What activities are there to do? You can visit the beach, take a stroll on the boardwalk, and try water sports. That sounds fun. Is there any specific accommodation you recommend? I've heard the Ocean View Inn is nice. It's right by the beach. Great, I'll look it up. How should we get there? By car or public transportation? It would be more convenient to go by car, so we can explore the area. Sounds good. Should we book the accommodation now or wait a bit? I suggest booking it soon, as weekends tend to get busy in Seaside. All right, let's do that. Should we also plan our meals ahead of time? It wouldn't hurt to make some restaurant reservations in advance. Good point. I'll check for some popular local restaurants in Seaside. Perfect. I'm really looking forward to our weekend getaway, aren't you? Absolutely. It'll be nice to escape the city and relax by the beach. Hi, I'm really excited about hosting a dinner party this weekend. That sounds fun. What's your plan for the menu? I want to make something special. Maybe a three-course meal. That sounds delicious. Do you have any dietary restrictions to consider? Yes, one of our guests is a vegetarian, so I need vegetarian options. How about starting with a fresh salad as the appetizer? That's a great idea. I'll make a mixed green salad with vinaigrette dressing. For the main course, you can make a vegetarian lasagna or stuffed peppers. Stuffed peppers sound interesting. I'll definitely consider that. And for dessert, how about a classic chocolate mousse? Perfect. I know everyone loves chocolate. I'll add that to the menu. Don't forget about drinks. Have you thought about what to serve? Since it's a dinner party, I'll offer a selection of red and white wines. Great idea. Will there be any non-alcoholic options for those who don't drink? Of course. I'll have some sparkling water and fruit juices available too. Sounds like you've got everything planned out. I'm sure it'll be a success. Thanks. I just hope everyone enjoys the food and has a good time.
I'm sure they will. Your attention to detail will make it a memorable evening. Hi there. I was thinking about what to do this weekend. Any ideas? Hmm. Well, the weather's looking great. Maybe we could go for a hike? That sounds like fun. Do you know any good hiking trails nearby? Yes, there's a beautiful trail in the mountains about an hour away. Perfect. Shall we meet at your place and drive there together? Sure, that works for me. What time should we leave? How about 9 a.m.? That way we can avoid the midday heat. Sounds like a plan. Should we bring some snacks and water? Definitely. I'll pack some sandwiches and we can each bring a water bottle. Great idea. Oh, and don't forget sunscreen and insect repellent. Good point. I'll make sure to pack those as well. Anything else? I think that covers it. Oh, maybe a small first aid kit, just in case. Excellent suggestion. I have one at home, so I'll grab that too. Perfect. Looks like we're all set for a fantastic hiking adventure. I can't wait. This is going to be an amazing weekend getaway. Hey, what are you up to this weekend? Not sure yet. Any suggestions? How about going hiking? It's a great way to relax. That sounds fun. Which trail do you recommend? I've heard good things about the Pinecrest Trail. Is it beginner friendly? I'm not an experienced hiker. Yes, it's perfect for beginners. It's not too challenging. Great. Should we bring any snacks or drinks? Definitely. We can pack some sandwiches and water. Sounds good. What time should we meet up? Let's meet at the trailhead at 9 a.m. Is that okay? Sounds perfect. I'll be there on time. Awesome. I'm looking forward to our hiking adventure. Me too. Thanks for suggesting it. Hi. Have you ever hosted a dinner party before? Yes, a few times. Why, are you thinking of hosting one too? Yes, I want to invite some friends over. Any tips? Well, first decide on a theme or cuisine for the party. That's a great idea. Maybe a Mexican theme? Perfect. Now, think about the number of guests you want to invite. I was thinking around 8 to 10 people. Is that manageable? Definitely. Next, plan the menu based on your theme. Should I cook everything myself or order some dishes? It depends on your cooking skills and time availability. I enjoy cooking, so I'll try to make most dishes myself. Great. Don't forget to include vegetarian options as well. Good point. What about drinks? Should I provide alcohol? It's always a good idea to have a variety of drink options. Noted. Should I think about any decorations or music? Yes, decorations and background music can enhance the ambiance. I'll make a checklist for all the things I need to do. That's a smart idea. It'll help you stay organized. Thanks for all the tips. I feel more confident now. You're welcome. I'm sure your dinner party will be a success. Hey, have you picked up any new hobbies recently? Yeah, I've started painting. 
It's so relaxing. You should try it. That sounds interesting. How did you get into painting? Well, I've always enjoyed art, so I decided to give it a try. Do you take classes or learn on your own? I started with online tutorials, but now I attend a local art studio. That's great. What type of paintings do you usually do? I mostly focus on landscapes and nature scenes. What about you? I actually enjoy playing musical instruments in my free time. That's cool. Which instruments do you play? I play the guitar and dabble a bit with the piano as well. Awesome. Do you perform in any bands or gigs? Not really. I mostly play for myself and sometimes jam with friends. That sounds like a lot of fun. We should have a painting and music session sometime. That sounds like a great idea. Let's plan it for next weekend. Hey, did you do any shopping today? Yeah, I went grocery shopping. How about you? I had to buy some new clothes for a party. Where did you go shopping for clothes? I went to a popular mall near my house. Did you find what you were looking for? Yes, I found a nice dress and some accessories. That's great. Did you get any discounts? Yes, luckily there was a sale going on. How much did you end up spending? I managed to stay within my budget, around $50. That's impressive. I always overspend while shopping. It takes practice to control impulsive buying. Any tips on how to become a smart shopper? Make a list, compare prices, and wait for sales. Hey. I've been trying to get into better shape lately. That's great. What kind of exercise routine are you following? Well, I've been going for a jog every morning. It helps clear my mind. Jogging is a fantastic way to start the day. Do you do any other exercises? Yes, I also do some strength training using dumbbells at home. Good for you. How often do you do your strength training workouts? I try to do it three times a week to give my muscles enough time to recover. That sounds like a smart plan. Have you noticed any changes in your body? Definitely. I've become more toned and I have more energy throughout the day. That's wonderful to hear. Do you stretch before and after your workouts? Yes, I always make sure to stretch to prevent any injuries or muscle tightness. Stretching is important. Are you also taking care of your diet? Yes, I've been eating more fruits, vegetables, and lean proteins. Excellent. A well-balanced diet is essential for overall health and fitness. I completely agree. I feel so much better since I started taking care of myself. It's amazing how taking small steps can make a big difference. Keep it up. Hey, what do you like to do in your free time? I enjoy gardening. It's so relaxing and rewarding. That sounds interesting. What kind of plants do you grow? I mainly grow flowers like roses and tulips. They are so beautiful. Do you have any tips for beginners who want to start gardening? Sure. Start small and choose plants suited to your climate. Does gardening require a lot of time and effort? 
It depends on the scale. But even a small garden needs regular care. I've been considering starting an indoor herb garden. Any advice? That's a great idea. Herbs like basil and mint are easy to grow indoors. How often should I water my indoor plants? It varies, but most indoor plants need watering once or twice a week. Thanks for the tips. I'll definitely give gardening a try. You're welcome. I'm sure you'll enjoy it. Happy gardening. Hi there. I've been thinking about throwing a dinner party. Oh, that sounds fun. Who are you planning on inviting? I thought about inviting our close friends from the neighborhood. Great idea. How many people do you have in mind? I was thinking about inviting about six people in total. That sounds perfect. When are you planning to have the party? I thought about having it next Saturday evening. Is that fine? Sure, that works for me. Have you thought about the menu yet? I was thinking of making a variety of appetizers, a main course, and dessert. Sounds delicious. Do you need any help with the preparations? That would be great. Would you mind helping me with the decorations? Of course, I'd love to help. Any specific theme or color scheme? How about a cozy and rustic theme, with warm earthy colors? I love that idea. Should we ask people to bring anything? I'll provide the main course, but we can ask guests to bring drinks. Sounds like a plan. Should we send out invitations or just text everyone? Let's send out formal invitations. I'll take care of that. Perfect. I'm looking forward to the dinner party. It'll be a blast. Good morning. Did you sleep well? Yes, I did. How about you? Ready for a new day? Definitely. Although I'm still a bit tired. How about breakfast? I usually have cereal and fruit. What about you? I prefer toast with jam and a cup of coffee. Sounds delicious. Do you have any morning rituals? Yes, I like to meditate for a few minutes before getting dressed. That's a great way to start the day. I usually exercise in the morning. Oh, I should try that too. What time do you usually wake up? I wake up at around 6.30 a.m. And you? I usually set my alarm for 7 a.m. What's the first thing you do after waking up? I brush my teeth and wash my face to freshen up. How about you? I do the same, and then I make my bed. It helps me feel organized. That's a good habit. I'll have to start doing that too. Hi, how are you doing today? Have any plans for the weekend? Hey, I'm good, thanks. Not really, just looking to relax. How about you? Same here. Actually, I was thinking of planning a weekend getaway. Any suggestions? That sounds like a great idea. How about a road trip to the countryside? Hmm. That could be interesting. What activities can we do there? We could go hiking and enjoy the scenic beauty. Or maybe try some horseback riding. I've never tried horseback riding before, but it sounds fun. Do we need any experience? Not at all. There are beginner-friendly trails and experienced instructors to guide us. Perfect. I'm excited about it. Any suggestions on where we can stay? 
We can book a cozy cottage through an online vacation rental website. Sounds cozy indeed. How about food? Any local delicacies we should try? Definitely. We can try the local farmer's market for fresh produce and homemade treats. That sounds delicious. Let's make a list of things to bring and plan for the next weekend. Great idea. We should pack some snacks, comfortable clothes, and don't forget the camera. Absolutely. I can't wait for this weekend getaway. It's going to be refreshing. Me too. I'm sure we'll have a fantastic time exploring the countryside together. Hey, I've been thinking about planning a vacation. That sounds exciting. Where are you thinking of going? I'm not sure yet. I'm considering a beach destination. That sounds relaxing. How about Hawaii? Hmm, I'm also considering Bali or the Maldives. Both sound amazing. Do you prefer active or laid-back trips? I think I want a mix of both. Some adventure and relaxation. How about trying water sports in Bali and unwinding on the beach? That could work. Any recommendations for activities in Hawaii? You can go snorkeling, hiking, or visit the volcanoes there. Sounds great. I'll make sure to do my research on those. Don't forget to check the weather and book accommodations in advance. Definitely. I want everything to go smoothly. Good luck with your planning. I'm sure you'll have an amazing time. Thanks. I'll let you know once I've finalized all the details. Hey, how was your day? Do anything interesting? Hi, not much, just went for a run in the park. What about you? Nice. I've been meaning to start running too. Where do you go? There's a nice trail near my house. It's peaceful and scenic. That sounds great. How often do you go running? I try to go at least three times a week. Keeps me fit and energized. Wow, that's impressive. I struggle with consistency. Any tips? Start small and gradually increase your distance and pace. It helps. I'll keep that in mind. What benefits have you noticed from running? Oh, many. Improved stamina, lower stress levels, and better sleep. I definitely need better sleep. Maybe I should give running a try. Absolutely. It's a great way to clear your mind and improve your health. Thanks for the advice. I'll let you know how it goes when I start. Sure. I'd love to hear about your running journey. Good luck. Thanks. I appreciate it. Take care and have a great day ahead. You too. Stay motivated. Catch you later. Hey, I heard you play a musical instrument. What do you play? Yes, I play the guitar. It's been a hobby of mine for years. That's awesome. How did you get into playing the guitar? Well, my dad used to play, so he taught me a few chords when I was younger. Do you play any other instruments besides the guitar? I also play the piano. It's a bit challenging, but I enjoy the diversity. That's great. How often do you practice your instruments? I try to practice at least an hour every day to keep improving my skills. Have you ever performed in front of an audience? Yes, I've played at a few local gigs and even participated in some music contests. 
Wow, that's impressive. Do you have a favorite genre of music to play? I'm into rock and blues, but I also like experimenting with different styles. Have you ever thought about joining a band or starting your own? Absolutely. I've been looking for fellow musicians to jam with and maybe form a band. That sounds like a lot of fun. Do you have any favorite guitarists? I'm a big fan of Jimi Hendrix and Eric Clapton. Their skills are exceptional. I totally agree. Well, it's great to know more about your musical talents. Thanks. Music is a huge part of my life and it brings me so much joy. Hi. Have you gone shopping lately? Yes, I actually went yesterday. How about you? I'm planning to go shopping for some new clothes this weekend. That sounds fun. Is there any specific item you're looking for? I really need a new outfit for an upcoming party. Any suggestions? How about a stylish dress? It's perfect for parties. Great idea. Do you know any good clothing stores nearby? Yes, there's a trendy boutique just a few blocks from here. Perfect. What should I consider when buying a dress? Well, you should consider the color, style, and fit that flatters you. Right. I want something that suits my body shape. Any tips? If you have an hourglass figure, a fitted dress would look great. I have more of an apple shape. What would you recommend? For apple shapes, empire waist dresses can be very flattering. Thanks for the advice. What about shoes and accessories? You could pair the dress with some heels and statement earrings. Sounds stylish. I'll definitely keep those in mind. Thanks. You're welcome. Have fun shopping and enjoy the party. Hey, how about we plan a weekend getaway? That sounds great. Where should we go? How about exploring a nearby national park? That's a fantastic idea. Which one? Have you heard of Green Valley National Park? Yes, I have. It's known for its breathtaking views. Perfect. Let's book a cabin and enjoy nature. Sounds like a peaceful getaway. When should we go? How about next month, during the long weekend? That works for me. Have you checked the weather? Yes, it's supposed to be sunny and pleasant. Excellent. We can go hiking and have picnics. Don't forget to pack a camera for memorable photos. Absolutely. I'll also bring some snacks and drinks. Great. Let's make sure to relax and unwind there. Hey, are you busy this weekend? Not really. Why? Any plans? I was thinking of planning a weekend getaway. Would you be interested? That sounds like a great idea. Where were you thinking of going? How about exploring a nearby city? I heard there's a lot to do and see. Sure, that sounds exciting. Do we need to book accommodation in advance? I think it's better to book in advance to avoid any last-minute hassles. All right. Let's look for some options online then. What's our budget? I think we can keep it reasonable. Maybe around $100 per night? Sounds good. Should we consider any specific activities or attractions? 
We can check out local museums, parks, and maybe go for a hike. That sounds like a plan. How long do you reckon the trip would be? I think a two-night stay should be enough. We can leave on Friday evening. Perfect. Let's start researching and book the accommodation today. Absolutely. I'll search for some options while you check out local attractions. Hey, I'm in the mood for some retail therapy. Want to go shopping? Sure. I could use some new clothes. Where should we start? How about the mall? They have a wide variety of stores to choose from. Sounds good. What type of clothing are you looking for? I want to find a trendy dress for a party next weekend. Great. I'm on the hunt for some comfortable jeans and a few casual tops. Let's check out the department stores first. They usually have a good selection. Good idea. We can compare prices and styles before making a decision. Look at this beautiful dress. I think it would be perfect for you. It does look nice, but it might be too formal for everyday wear. You're right. Let's keep looking. How about this pair of jeans? They seem comfortable, but I prefer a darker wash. Let's keep exploring. I just spotted a boutique with unique clothing. Shall we give it a try? Sure, why not? It's always fun to discover new fashion brands. I love this top. It's stylish and affordable. What do you think? It suits you perfectly. I found a pair of jeans that I really like too. Awesome. Shall we head to the fitting rooms to try everything on? Yes, let's do it. I'm excited to see how our new outfits will look. Hey, have you heard about the new fitness class at the gym? Yeah, I've heard it's really challenging. Have you tried it? No, not yet. But I'm thinking of giving it a go next week. That's great. What kind of exercises do they do in the class? I heard it's a mix of cardio, strength training, and Pilates. Oh, that sounds intense. Are you prepared for the challenge? I've been working out regularly, so I think I can handle it. That's good to hear. I might join you and try it out as well. That would be awesome. It's always more fun with a workout buddy. Definitely. Plus, it's always motivating to have someone to push you. Absolutely. We can hold each other accountable and stay committed. I agree. Let's make a plan and go to the class together next week. Sounds like a plan. I'll check the schedule and let you know the details. Perfect. Looking forward to trying out the new fitness class with you. Hey, how are you? How was your morning? Good morning. I'm doing well. My morning was pretty busy. What time did you wake up? I woke up at 7 a.m. What about you? I woke up a bit later at 8.30 a.m. What did you do next? After waking up, I brushed my teeth and took a quick shower. Did you have time for breakfast? Unfortunately, I didn't. I had to rush out the door for work. That's too bad. Breakfast is important. How do you go to work? I usually take the bus. It's convenient and saves me time. What time do you usually arrive at work? I reach the office around 8.45 a.m. I try to be punctual. That's impressive. 
How do you feel in the morning? I'm not a morning person, so I usually feel a bit groggy. I understand. I need at least two cups of coffee to wake up. Haha, ha, coffee does help. I should start drinking it too. Well, I hope you have a productive day at work. Thank you. Have a great day too. See you later. Good morning. How was your night? Good morning. It was restful, thanks. How about you? I had a bit of trouble falling asleep, but I'm fine. That happens sometimes. Did you set an alarm? Yes, I set it for 6.30 a.m., but I snoozed it a bit. I understand, sometimes it's hard to get out of bed. Exactly. So, after getting up, I took a quick shower. Sounds refreshing. Did you have time for breakfast? Not really, I grabbed a banana on my way out. You should try to have a proper breakfast, it's important. I know, but I was running late. I'll have lunch instead. Fair enough. Did you leave your house on time, though? No, I was rushing. I hope the traffic isn't too bad. Fingers crossed. Make sure to take breaks at work. I will. Thanks for the reminder. Have a great day. You're welcome. Have a productive day too. Take care. Hey, what are your plans for the weekend? I'm not sure yet. Maybe catch up on some rest. Rest? That sounds boring. How about going hiking? That's a great idea. I could use some fresh air. Perfect. There's a beautiful trail nearby. Awesome. What time should we meet? Let's say 9 a.m. at the entrance of the trail. Sounds good. Should we bring anything? Definitely some water and snacks for the hike. I'll bring some sandwiches and fruits. Great. I'll bring a backpack for our things. Don't forget sunscreen and insect repellent. Yes, safety first. Anything else we need? Maybe a map or a GPS, just in case. Good point. I'll bring my phone with a map app. Perfect. I can't wait to explore the nature. Me too. It's going to be a fantastic weekend. Hey, have you found a new place to live yet? Not yet. I'm still searching for a new apartment. What are your criteria for the new place? I'm looking for a one-bedroom apartment with natural light. Location is also important. Any specific preferences? I'd prefer a place near public transportation and grocery stores. How about the neighborhood? Any preferences there? I'm looking for a safe and quiet neighborhood. Have you set a budget for the rent? Yes, I'm aiming for something within $1,000 a month. Have you started browsing online listings? Yes, I've been checking various websites for available options. It's a good idea to schedule some apartment viewings. Definitely. I'll start contacting landlords to arrange visits. Don't forget to ask about lease terms and utility costs. Thanks for the reminder. I'll make sure to gather all information. Good luck with your apartment search. Let me know how it goes. Thank you. I'll keep you updated on any progress I make. 
Hey, how have you been keeping fit lately? I've actually started a new exercise routine. It's been great. Really? Tell me more about it. I need some inspiration. Well, I've been doing a mix of cardio and strength training. That sounds effective. How often do you exercise? I try to work out at least three times a week. What about you? I've been slacking off lately, but I want to get back on track. Don't worry, just start small and build up gradually. Any specific exercises or workouts you recommend? I love doing HIIT workouts. They're intense but efficient. Sounds interesting. Do you do them at home or at the gym? I do them at home. All I need is some space and a mat. That's convenient. I might give it a try too. Thanks. No problem. Let me know if you need any guidance. Hey, I'm really in need of a break. Any ideas for our weekend getaway? Absolutely. How about a cozy cabin retreat near the mountains? That sounds like a great idea. We could relax and enjoy some fresh air. I know a place that offers hiking trails and beautiful scenery. Perfect. Does the cabin have a kitchen? I'd love to cook some meals. Yes, it's fully equipped. We can save money by cooking our own food. That's a smart idea. Besides hiking, what other activities are available? We can go fishing by the lake and have a bonfire in the evenings. That sounds like a lot of fun. Do we need to bring our own fishing equipment? No worries. The cabin provides all the necessary fishing gear for guests. Excellent. How far is it from here? I don't want to spend too much time driving. It's just a two-hour drive. We'll arrive in no time and have more time to relax. That's perfect. Let's book the cabin and start packing for our weekend escape. Agreed. I'll take care of the booking while you gather the essentials. Can't wait. Hey, have you heard about the recent social media hacks? Yes, it's quite concerning. We should learn how to use it safely. Absolutely. I've been reading about online privacy and security measures. That's a great start. What are some tips you've come across? Well, it's advised to use strong and unique passwords for each account. True, and enabling two-factor authentication adds an extra layer of security. Right. I've also learned to be cautious about the information I share online. Definitely, it's better to avoid sharing personal details publicly. Another thing I learned is to be mindful of phishing scams and suspicious links. Yes, we should always double-check before clicking on any unfamiliar links. Additionally, it's important to review and adjust our privacy settings regularly. That's a good point. Staying updated with the platform's privacy policies helps too. Agreed. We should be aware of who can see our posts and control our visibility. Absolutely. Using social media safely requires constant vigilance and awareness. It may take some effort, but it's worth protecting our personal information. Definitely, let's continue educating ourselves and encourage others to do the same. Hey, what's your favorite type of cuisine to eat? I love Italian food, especially pasta dishes. What about you? 
I'm a fan of Asian cuisine, particularly Chinese food. Oh, really? What's your go-to Chinese dish then? I enjoy eating sweet and sour chicken with fried rice. That sounds delicious. Have you ever tried sushi? Yes, I have. I like sushi rolls, especially California rolls. Nice. I also enjoy Mexican food, like tacos and burritos. Oh, I love Mexican food too. Do you like spicy food? Yes, I can handle a bit of spice. How about you? I'm not a big fan of spicy food, but I can handle mild flavors. That's fair. Have you ever tried Indian cuisine before? Yes, I have. I enjoy dishes like chicken tikka masala. Great. I think we have quite similar food preferences then. Hey, I've been thinking about taking a weekend getaway. Any suggestions? Absolutely. How about a road trip to a nearby coastal town? That sounds great. What activities can we do there? We can go hiking by the cliffs, visit a lighthouse, and relax on the beach. Sounds like a plan. How do we get there by car? It's about a three-hour drive. We can use GPS for directions and avoid traffic. Good idea. Should we book accommodation in advance? Yes, it's better to secure a place early. I can handle the bookings if you want. That would be awesome. What type of accommodation are you thinking? How about a cozy cottage by the beach? It'll give us the ultimate relaxation. I like the sound of that. Are there any nearby restaurants or cafes? Yes, we can try local seafood at a beachfront restaurant or enjoy a cup of coffee by the pier. Yum! I can't wait. Is there anything else we should pack? Sunscreen, beach towels, and comfortable shoes for our hikes would be essential. Perfect. When should we leave? I suggest leaving early Saturday morning to make the most of our weekend getaway. Sounds like a plan. I'm really excited about this trip. Thank you for your help. You're welcome. It's going to be a memorable adventure. Let's have a great time. Hey, have you heard about any good movies lately? Yeah, actually. I heard about a new action film. Oh, that sounds exciting. Where is it playing? It's showing at the local theater downtown. Great. Let's go see it this weekend, if you're free. That sounds like a plan. What time should we go? How about the 7 p.m. showtime? Does that work? Perfect. I'll mark it on my calendar. Do we need to buy tickets in advance? I think it's a popular film, so it might be a good idea. Okay. Let's buy them online to avoid any last-minute hassle. Good idea. I'll check the theater's website for ticket prices. Sounds good. Let me know how much they are, and I'll Venmo you. No worries, I can cover the tickets this time. Consider it a treat. Oh, that's so kind of you. I'll grab the popcorn then. Deal. Let's meet outside the theater at 6.45 p.m. on Saturday. Agreed. I'm looking forward to a fun movie night with you. Hey, have you finished your shopping for the weekend? Not yet. I still need to pick up a few things. How about you? 
Yeah, I have a list of groceries to buy. Wanna go together? Sure, let's meet at the supermarket. What time works for you? How about we meet at 2 p.m.? It gives us enough time. Sounds good. Is there anything specific you need? I need some fruits, vegetables, and dairy products. What about you? I need to grab some bread, chicken, and cleaning supplies. Okay, let's start with the produce section. We can get fruits and veggies there. Great idea. And then we can move on to the meat aisle for chicken. Don't forget to pick up some eggs and milk from the dairy section. Got it. Should we get some snacks for movie night too? Yeah, let's head to the snack aisle. I'm in the mood for popcorn. Alright, let's not forget to check for any ongoing discounts. Good point. It's always great to save some money. I completely agree. Alright, let's start our shopping adventure. Hey, I was thinking about doing something fun this weekend. Any ideas? How about going for a hike in the nearby forest? It's supposed to be beautiful. That sounds great. I haven't been hiking in a while. What time should we meet? Let's meet at 9 a.m. near the entrance. It's better to start early to avoid the heat. Perfect. Should we bring any snacks or drinks? Yes, it would be a good idea to pack some water and maybe some energy bars. All right, I'll make sure to bring those. Do you know how long the hike usually takes? It usually takes about three to four hours, depending on our pace. We can take breaks if needed. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. Is there anything else we should bring? It's always a good idea to bring sunscreen, insect repellent, and a hat to protect from the sun. Got it. I'll pack those as well. Oh, and should we bring our cameras too? Definitely. The forest has some amazing scenery, so we should capture those beautiful moments. I'm really excited about this hike. It's going to be a refreshing break from the city life. Me too. Nature always helps clear the mind and rejuvenate the soul. Let's make the most of it. Hi, how was your weekend? It was great. I spent most of my time working on my hobby. Oh, what is your hobby? I really enjoy gardening. It's so relaxing and rewarding. That sounds lovely. What kind of plants do you grow? I mainly focus on growing vegetables like tomatoes, cucumbers, and lettuce. That's impressive. Do you have any tips for a beginner like me? Sure. First, make sure you have good soil and plenty of sunlight for your plants. I'll keep that in mind. How much time do you spend on gardening each week? I try to spend at least a couple of hours each day tending to my plants. It sounds like a lot of work, but also very rewarding. Definitely. Seeing my plants grow and eventually harvesting fresh produce is amazing. I may give gardening a try. It sounds like a great hobby to distress. I highly recommend it. Plus, you get to enjoy the fruits of your labor. Thank you for sharing your experience. I'll start researching more about gardening. You're welcome. Let me know if you have any questions. Good luck with your new hobby. Hey. Have you seen any nice dresses around here? Definitely. There's a new boutique down the street. 
Sounds good. What kind of styles do they have? They have a variety, from casual to formal dresses. I need something formal for an evening event. They might have what you're looking for. Let's check it out. Do they have any dresses in my favorite color, blue? I'm not sure, but they usually have a wide color selection. Great. I hope they have my size too. Don't worry, they usually carry different sizes as well. Do they have a dressing room for trying on the dresses? Yes, they do. You can try on as many as you want. That's convenient. How is the pricing there? The prices are reasonable for the quality they offer. Do they accept credit cards or is it cash only? They accept both credit cards and cash, so you're covered. I'm really excited to find a beautiful dress. I'm sure you'll find something perfect for your event. Thank you for suggesting this boutique to me. You're welcome. Let's go check it out right now. Yes, let's go and start our dress shopping adventure. I can't wait to see you in a stunning new dress. Hey, have you ever played a musical instrument before? Yeah, I used to play the piano when I was younger. What about you? I've always wanted to learn how to play the guitar. It seems really cool. That's awesome. The guitar is a great instrument to start with. You should give it a try. I'm a bit afraid of not being able to pick it up quickly. Is it difficult to learn? It can be challenging at first, but with practice and dedication, anyone can play it well. How did you manage to learn to play the piano? Did you take lessons? Yes, I took lessons for a few years. It was a lot of hard work, but it was definitely worth it. I don't think I have the patience for lessons. Is there any other way to learn? You can try online tutorials or even learn from books. It may take longer, but it's still possible. That's a good idea. I'll definitely look into that. Any tips for someone starting out? Start with the basics and practice regularly. Don't get discouraged if progress is slow at first. Thanks for the advice. Maybe someday we can play together. That would be really fun. Absolutely. I'd love that. Good luck with your guitar journey. You'll do great. Hey, I'm thinking of taking a short trip this weekend. Any recommendations? Sure. What kind of activities are you interested in for your getaway? I'm open to anything fun and relaxing. Maybe some outdoor activities or sightseeing. How about visiting a nearby national park? It's a great way to unwind and enjoy nature. That sounds perfect. Which national park would you suggest? I want to avoid crowded places. Well, there's a less known park called Pine Ridge National Park. It's serene and less touristy. Sounds ideal. How can I get there? Are there any public transportation options available? You can take a bus or train to the nearest town and then rent a car to reach the park easily. That sounds doable. How about accommodation? Are there any cabins or lodges nearby? Yes, there are several cozy lodges and cabins near the park. I can help you find some options. That would be great. Can you also look up some local attractions and hiking trails in the park? Absolutely. I'll prepare a list of must-see spots and popular trails for you to explore. Thanks. 
I appreciate your help. By the way, how's the weather forecast for this weekend? According to the forecast, it will be sunny with mild temperatures, perfect for outdoor activities. That's fantastic news. I'm really looking forward to this weekend getaway. Thanks again. You're welcome. Have a wonderful trip and don't forget to share your adventures with me. Hey, have you ever traveled internationally? Yes, I have. Why do you ask? I'm planning a trip to Europe and could use some advice. Sure, I'd be happy to help. Where in Europe are you thinking of going? I'm considering France, Italy, and Spain. Any recommendations? All three are amazing choices. How long are you planning to stay? I have about two weeks. Do you think that's enough time? It depends on how many cities you want to visit. Which ones are a must-see for you? I definitely want to visit Paris, Rome, and Barcelona. Great choices. Have you thought about the mode of transportation? I was thinking of flying between cities. Is that the best option? It usually is, but for shorter distances, you could also consider taking trains or buses. That makes sense. Are there any websites you recommend for booking flights? I usually use popular travel websites like Expedia or Kayak. They have good deals. Thank you for the advice. I'm so excited to start planning my trip. You're welcome. If you have any more questions, feel free to ask. Have a great trip. Hi there. Have you ever traveled abroad? Yes, I have. I love exploring new places. How about you? I haven't had the chance yet but I'm planning a trip soon. That's exciting. Have you decided on a destination? I'm thinking of going to Europe. Any suggestions? Europe is a great choice. How long are you planning to stay? I have around two weeks for the trip. Is that enough? It depends on how many countries you want to visit. I was thinking of exploring two or three countries. That should be doable. Which countries are you interested in? I'm really fascinated by Italy and Spain. Those are both beautiful countries with rich history. Do you have any recommendations on what to see in Italy? Rome, Florence, and Venice are must-visit cities there. And what about Spain? Any specific cities worth seeing? Barcelona and Madrid are definitely worth checking out. Thanks for the suggestions. I'll start planning my itinerary. Hey, I've been itching for a getaway. Any ideas for a weekend trip? Absolutely. How about a relaxing beach escape close to home? Sounds great. Any particular place you have in mind? Well, we could head to a charming coastal town called Rivertown. Rivertown? Never heard of it. What's so special about it? It's known for its pristine beaches, picturesque views, and vibrant nightlife. That sounds perfect. How do we get there? Is it far from here? It's only a four-hour drive from here, so it's quite accessible. That's not bad at all. Do we need to book accommodations in advance? It's always a good idea to book early to get the best deals. Shall I do it? Yes, please. And let's find a place close to the beach, if possible. Sure thing. 
I'll look for beachfront hotels or cozy beachside cottages. Great. While you do that, I'll make a list of things to do and see there. Perfect. We should have plenty of options to keep ourselves entertained. I heard they have a famous seafood restaurant there. Should we try it? Definitely. I'll make a note of that and include it in our itinerary. Awesome. I'm already excited for this getaway. It'll be so much fun. I couldn't agree more. It's going to be an amazing weekend escape. Hey there. Have you ever thought about taking a weekend trip? Yeah, I've been wanting to escape the city for a while. Any suggestions? Well, there are plenty of options nearby. How about going to a beach? That sounds great. Which beach do you recommend? I've heard good things about Paradise Beach. It's about a two-hour drive from here. Sounds perfect. Do you know if there are any hotels near the beach? Yes, there's a nice resort called Coastal Retreat. It's right by the beach. Great. Should we book our rooms in advance? Definitely, it might get crowded on weekends. Shall I make the reservation? Sure. Let's book two rooms for Friday and Saturday night. All right. I'll take care of that. What activities do you want to do there? I'd love to swim, relax on the beach, and maybe try some water sports. Sounds fun. We should also explore the local seafood restaurants. Absolutely. I've heard the seafood in that area is delicious. I'll look up some recommendations online before we go. Should we rent a car? I think it's a good idea. It will be easier to get around and explore nearby areas. Okay. I'll arrange for a car rental as well. Anything else we need to plan? I think that covers everything. Let's make this weekend getaway amazing. Hi there. Have you gone shopping for clothes recently? Yes, I actually went yesterday. Found anything interesting? I did. I bought a nice pair of jeans and some t-shirts. That sounds great. Where did you go shopping? I went to the mall. They had a great selection of stores. Which store did you find the jeans at? I got them at a large department store on the second floor. Did you try them on before buying? Yes, I did. I always make sure they fit well before buying. That's a good idea. Were they on sale? Yes, luckily they were. I got them at a discounted price. That's a great deal. I need to go shopping soon too. Let me know if you need any company. I enjoy shopping. That's kind of you. I might take you up on that offer. Sure, just let me know when you plan to go. Hi, I've been thinking about taking a small trip. Any suggestions? Absolutely. How about planning a weekend getaway? It's an ideal way to relax. That sounds great. Where do you suggest we go? How about a charming coastal town? They usually offer a mix of relaxation and adventure. Oh, I love the sound of that. What activities can we do there? We can go hiking along the cliffs, exploring the local markets, and maybe even try surfing. Surfing? I've never done that before. Is it difficult? Not at all. The instructors there are experienced and can teach us the basics. 
That sounds exciting. How about accommodation? Should we book a hotel? Since it's a weekend trip, why not try an Airbnb? It's a more authentic experience. I like that idea. Do you have any recommendations for Airbnb locations? Sure. I'll send you some options later today so we can choose the perfect one. Perfect. I'm really looking forward to this weekend getaway. Thanks for suggesting it. No problem. It's always nice to take a break and explore new places. Let's have fun. Hey, did you hear about the band playing tomorrow? Yes, I heard they're amazing. Want to go together? Absolutely. What time does the concert start? It starts at 8 p.m., so we should meet around 7. Sounds good. Where should we meet? How about at the entrance of the venue? Perfect. Should we buy the tickets beforehand? Definitely. We don't want to miss out. How much are the tickets? They're $50 each. We can buy them online. Great. I'll purchase mine right away. Once we have them, let's plan a dinner before. Good idea. Any specific cuisine you're in the mood for? How about Italian? There's a nice restaurant nearby. Sounds perfect. Let's meet there at 6 p.m. then. Agreed. It's going to be an awesome night. Nice day today, isn't it? Yes, it's sunny and warm. Perfect for a picnic. I agree. The weather has been great lately. It's been a nice change from the rain we had last week. Definitely. I hope it stays like this for a while. Me too. I'm planning to go hiking this weekend. That sounds fun. I might go to the beach myself. Oh, the beach sounds lovely. I haven't been in a while. Well, if the weather holds up, It'll be a perfect day. I hope so. Do you think it will rain anytime soon? I haven't heard any forecasts for rain, so fingers crossed. Let's hope for the best. Enjoy your time at the beach. Thanks, you too. Have a great hike. Hey, have you done any shopping lately? Yes, I actually went shopping yesterday. What about you? I went shopping last week. What did you buy? I bought a new pair of jeans and some sneakers. Oh, nice. Where did you find them? I found them at a local department store near my place. Did you get any good deals? Yes. I got the jeans on sale, and the sneakers had a discount too. That's great. I need to find some new clothes too. What are you looking for specifically? I'm looking for a new dress for an upcoming event. Have you tried checking out the boutiques in the city center? No, I haven't. Are they expensive? Not necessarily, you can find a range of prices there. That sounds promising. I'll definitely give it a try. Good luck. Let me know if you find something nice. Thanks, I will. I'll also let you know about any good deals I find. Hi. How's it going? Any plans for the weekend? Hey, I was actually thinking of going on a short trip. How about you? That sounds great. I've been craving a change of scenery. Where do you suggest? 
Well, I've heard wonderful things about the nearby national park. Want to explore it? Oh, yes. I've seen breathtaking pictures of it. What activities are available there? Hiking, camping, bird watching, and even kayaking on the lake. Plenty to choose from. Perfect. Let's make a list of what we need to bring along for a fun weekend. Good idea. We'll need tents, hiking boots, a first aid kit, and some insect repellent. Don't forget food and water. Is there a place nearby where we can buy supplies? Yes, there's a small grocery store about 15 minutes away from the park entrance. Great. Let's plan to leave early Saturday morning, so we can make the most of it. Sounds like a plan. Should we stay for just one night or make it a two-night trip? Hmm, I think two nights would be better. Gives us more time to explore and relax. I agree. I'll book a campsite for us right away. Do you have a preference for the area? As long as it's close to scenic spots, I'm happy. Surprise me with the booking. Okay, I'll make sure to find a spot with great views. Can't wait for our getaway. Me neither. It'll be a refreshing break from the usual routine. Looking forward to it.